We are here for the first episode of WWE 2K24's My Rise. Let's get right into it. Oh, we on the bump, baby? Let's go. Welcome to the bump and what is shaping up to be the most chaotic SummerSlam week in WWE history. I'm Byron Saxton. And I'm Kayla Braxton. Less than a week before defending the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against Cody Rhodes in a brand versus brand main event at SummerSlam, Roman Reigns shocked the world and surrendered his title. The head of the table what? that he's been beating up Cody for years now, and wow. he has nothing more to prove. Now he's taking a sabbatical in Hollywood to show his cousin, The Rock, that he will be a bigger superstar there, too. With SummerSlam in disarray and the draft set to begin the night after, Triple H called for a one-night WWE Universal title tournament with selections from the GMs of both Raw and SmackDown. Raw GM William Regal named Cody as Raw's first entrant and said he was confident the title would be coming. Coming to Raw. But SmackDown's brand new general manager, The Miz, didn't find this awesome. He called the attempt to take his WWE Universal Championship to Raw nothing short of theft. And The Miz is in it to win it for his brand. He's sending a team of killers to bring that title home. Let's take a look. Kayla, we know what Braun Strowman brings to a fight. AJ Styles is always a threat. If you ask me, though, KO is the man to beat in this whole tournament. He's been hungry for the opportunity. Reigns has left him here. That sounds like he was waiting for crumbs from Roman's table, Byron. William Regal's entries are no slouches. Finn Balor was the first Universal Champion. Much of the WWE Universe believes this is Gunter's time, and Cody Rhodes has been looking to finish the story for a while now. That last slot, though, Kayla, what is Regal's strategy there? William Regal still has one foot in developing young superstars. Raw's GM is going to make a match on the SummerSlam kickoff show for that last slot in the tournament. Your guy, Kevin Owens. I mean, I wouldn't call him my guy. Your guy is not going to know his opponent until the winner of that match, and neither will we. Yo, so much just happened. The Miz is SmackDown GM. Roman relinquished his championship. What the hell's going on? Yeah, we running them ropes, baby. Brandon Collins is ready for his opportunity. What up, Regal? What's poppin'? Don't blow yourself up, young man. You're up to have a long night. Mr. Regal. Coming in early to help the ring crew, running the ropes while everyone else is still at the hotel, it makes an impression. Thanks. I do my best. Do you? What do you mean? Do you do your best? Apply yourself. You sound like my old math teacher. Well... You came to Raw more than a year ago now, and you've yet to make much of an impression. No titles, no great rivalries, a win-loss record with just enough victories to fly under the radar. Uh, great pep talk? Let me finish. I see your potential. The question is, if you're ready to fulfill it. I'm ready. Good, because as you know, there's a tournament for the WWE Universal Championship tonight. The final slot for Raw will be decided in a match on the kickoff show. One of the combatants will be Dominic Mysterio. That young man has a future, a legacy, a name. The other competitor is you. Let's go. Thank you, sir. So much. I'll bring my best. Good man. See you do. You're the long shot of this whole night, my boy. You're the dark horse. Beat the odds. You already know we will, baby. Come on. Stop playing with the sparring. Let's go. I'm ready to have my first match. Hit the ropes again, baby. The WWE Universal Championship Tournament begins on the SummerSlam kickoff show as Dominic faces off against the dark horse of the tournament, Brandon Collins, in a qualifying match. Roman Reigns says the real dark horse is Cody Rhodes. I personally guarantee that he is not going home with my undisputed WWE Universal title tonight. Let's check my DMs. What did Regal say? Remember what I said? It doesn't matter what you've done up until this point. You can make your impression tonight. Give it your best shot, and there's no telling how far you'll go. Well, we're doing a whole lot of talking. I'm ready for some fighting. Let's go. Well, look who it is. If it isn't SummerSlam's Dark Horse. That nickname is sticking. Good times. Good times? Is Raw trying to steal SmackDown's WWE Universal title? Between us, what is Regal really up to? Um, giving me an opportunity to win the WWE Universal Championship? He put you in a qualifying match. You think that's some kind of vote of confidence? Come on, don't be naive. 
A knot? What are you getting at? You know he has all his royal eggs in the Cody Rhodes basket. He's just trying to set the American Nepo baby up to win. I'll tell you what, the draft starts tomorrow. You beat Dominic, maybe I bring you over to SmackDown in the supplemental. We'll make a big announcement on social media. Oh, you'll post about me? For real? <laughs> Why would you want me in the tournament instead of Dom anyway? Because I want the WWE Universal title on my show, where it belongs. And I am 100% sure KO will beat you. Okay, no chance. Coming to SmackDown? Man, that is a very generous offer and a wicked smart strategy, Miz. But I have just one little thing I'm bumping on. What's that? It's just that I would rather have my fingernails pulled out with needle nose pliers than ever work for an entitled, condescending reality show hack like you. Bam, you tell him, Brandon. I promise that you will regret that. Miz, this right now, this conversation, talking to you, that's what I regret. Damn, roasted. <laughs> you got him. All right, it's time for our match. How many upgrade points I got? A 205 upgrade points? We're a 75 overall. I want that up a little bit. Hold up, hold up. Look at that. We just went from a 75 to an 86. I like the way this is looking. Let's go to the match. Our first match in this My Rise is against Dirty Dominic Mysterio. And this man gonna run at me already. Dom, what is the plan, bro? Come on now, the Spartan is not gonna play around. Let's go. Oh, I, I was late on that? Abdominal stretch? I am not tapping this early, Dom. Uh-uh. We're not doing this. Let's go. Big reversal from the Spartan. I'm playing this before the game is coming out, so shout out to 2K for giving us a code early. That's why your boy don't have any logos on right now. We'll, we'll add that later. Brandon Collins is in full control right now. Oh, big cutter to start out in this SummerSlam qualifying match into the cover, but it's going to be a rope break already. Oh, Dom with the big counter. Elbow to the face. Where you... Dom, what the hell was that? What are you thinking, bro? We're going to lift this man up, drop him in the center of the ring, hook of the leg. Let's see if we can put him away early. Oh, only going to be a one count. All right. Look, if the whole tournament is tonight, we got to save our energy. I don't want to I don't want to take too much time to put this man away. Oh, big exploder gets dropped on his head. You want to get dropped on your head again? Say less. Another exploder. Oh, Dom with the reversal. What a counter. And he takes me down with the clothesline. To the ropes goes Brandon Collins all the way to the outside. Dom taking his sweet time. Yeah, you goofed, buddy. You goofed. I'm trying to hurt dirty Dominic Mysterio. Oh, big spinner Rudy. Oh, my God. Yo, is this man good? Let's get Dom back in. Get on your feet, Dom. Get on your feet. Let's go. Time for the SIG. Big blockbuster. One, two. Oh, but Dom gets the shoulder up just in time. You know what it's time for, baby. Get up on your feet, Dom. In the first knee of glory of the my right now. Dom reversed it. Dominic Mysterio reversed the knee of glory. Absolutely tragic. Oh, oh, big counter. Big counter. Let's go. Time for the finish. Super kick. Let's go. Knee of glory. We got all of it. That's got to be it for Dom. Count to 10. Oh, what? Yo, yo, Dom's not playing. It's going to take way more than that to put Dominic Mysterio away, apparently. From the top, big frog splash. One, two, and we got it. The frog splash was enough. Sorry, Tom and Nick. <laughs> Let's go, baby. Big win. I beat Dom with his own move, basically. Your boy will be advancing in this tournament. That is what you love to see. After Brandon defeated Dominic Mysterio in a qualifying match, he will face Kevin Owens in the first round of the WWE Universal Championship Tournament. I can guarantee that the winner, not Brandon, will be the most must-see champion on my show, SmackDown. Yo, Miz, if you got a problem, come talk to me, bro. Let's settle this in a ring. Oh, look who it is. The American Nightmare. There he is. Great match with Dominic out there. Regal made the right call opening that last slot up. We're in the opposite bracket, but I'm kind of hoping you make it to the final. Real Cinderella story. Is that like some kind of reverse psychology mind game? Hell no. You make it to the final, I'm aiming to beat you just like I was going to beat Reigns. You know what? I'm going to show Cody some respect. It's just a little friendly competition, all right? Is that right? Hope you make it to the finals with some nice, short, easy matches on the way. Damn. I want everyone to know I beat you at your best. Oh, see, see, a little friendly competition. I like you, Cody. I got nothing against you. That's the spirit. Good luck tonight, brother. Same to you. I'll see you in the main event in a few hours. Let's go. Let's go. 
What up, Kevin? It's me and you next. KO, first round of the WWE Universal Title Tournament. Let's do this. Seriously? Are you literally the most desperate superstar on Raw? Why are you coming at me like this? And catering? That's crazy. I'm just saying. Oh, KO, I'm so excited to fight you. What the hell have you ever done to even deserve being in the same room as the WWE Universal Championship? You want to know what I've done to get here? It was a rhetorical question. What you've done is take the opportunity to showcase your craft on the biggest stage in the world and flush it right down the toilet. You've been over on Raw for what, two years now? And most of the WWE Universe doesn't even know your name. All you are is some charity project for Regal. Wow, okay, Kevin, it's like that? I'm nobody's project. Half right, you're definitely a nobody. See you out there. Kevin, I'm about to whoop your candy ass. Kevin Owens did a lot of trash talking, but let's see if he can back it up. Let's go. This man running at me already. Knock some sense into KO with a heavy combo. I'm not going to lie. I forgot how to even do a heavy combo. <laughs> I think this. Okay, I did it. I did it. Let's go. Keep the pressure on Kevin Owens. Oh, we can do that. We can definitely do that. We got to keep the pressure on KO right now. Oh, he got the reversal on that? Yo, let me breathe for a second, dude. Oh, I was too early. Yo, yo, I'm slacking. Oh, no, you are not even going to get a one count yet. The match just started, KO. Oh, let's go. We already got the counter. Victory in sight. Grab KO. I can do that. What's the plan? Oh, all right. Little cutscene action. Oh, stutter. No, not like this. Not like this. Really, Kevin? We're going to be cocky right now. Don't think you're sweet, Kevin. I'll put you away too, so fast. So fast. What is happening right now? Oh, yes, please roll him out. I was about to say. Let's go. We stole the win. Let's go, dude. Two easy wins back to back. See, this is what happens when you get cocky, Kevin. You should have played serious, man. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Another stunner. Really? You're that salty? Come on, dude. My health is about to be so low going into this third match. Hey, but you know what, though? A win is a win. <laughs> Let's see here. I beat Strowman. I beat Styles. I sure as hell beat Cody. That dark horse I haven't beat, I'll beat him when I get back if he still has a job. Yo, go film a movie. Don't worry about your boy. Did the dark horse of the WWE Universal title tournament just beat Kevin Owens to advance or did Kevin Owens beat himself? No comment. You're fired. <laughs> Don't you just love when Kevin Owens beats himself? The dark horse of the undisputed WWE Universal title tournament faces his toughest challenge yet in the monstrous Braun Strowman next on SummerSlam. All right, it's about that time. Our toughest challenge yet, the monster among men, Braun Strowman. Show Braun you have no fear and defeat him. I got no fear against Red Pants Man. Let's go, big knee. I'm not wasting any time. Oh, big weave, what? What? I dodged that and he still got it. He's just he's just too big. Into the corner. Charles, you seeing this? <laughs> Charles, I'm getting my ass whooped. Charles, help. Well, let's go. Oh, big dodge. Big dodge. Turn him around and another rip cord knee. We got to do big moves early on here. Another DDT on the apron. Get your big ass back in the ring. We got the SIG ready to go. Big SIG. Big SIG. 450. No. I got none of that. I got absolutely none of that. And Braun Strowman just tossed me across the ring. Oh, he's got rage. He's got rage. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Is that his finish? Is that his finish? Oh, my God. The running power slam from Braun Strowman into the cover. Oh, come on. Easy. <laughs> Not even mean to kick out that early for real. Oh, big counter. They start, they're chanting fight forever right now. Oh, big move to Braun Strowman on the outside. Let's go, dude. We are on fire right now. Let's go, Braun. Let's go, Braun. All right. Run to the ropes. Oh, near glory. I don't know what Braun was looking for, but it didn't matter. Hook at a leg. Is that it? Oh, for a second, I thought we had that. Let's go. I got something that'll put him away. No, no. Oh, let's go. What? I still got that. Let's go. Buckshot for the win. One, two, and we did it. I don't know how that landed, but the Buckshot gets the win. Big moves, and we advance in the tournament. That's three down. Everyone is calling my opponent the Dark Horse, but I think he's one of the next generation of great WWE superstars. Good luck in the finals, Brandon. You're going to need it. We got The Miz and William Regal. This is a setup, Regal. 
I take over as the general manager of SmackDown, and all of a sudden there's a tournament for my show's title with a bunch of Raw guys, and now two of them made it to the finals? Mizanin, surely you cannot believe that I somehow conspired with Roman Reigns to abdicate his title. Perhaps he simply didn't want to work with you. That is ridiculous. Roman loves me, and that's not the point. You and Triple H and all your little buddies skulking around to anoint Cody Rhodes, you set this up for Cody to face this guy. Hello again, Miz. I thought about your offer to come to SmackDown if I did okay against Dom and then lost to KO. I decided to beat him instead. Oh, and Braun too. Looks like I made the right choice including you in this tournament. Oh, look at the Mutual Admiration Society. Can you really not see what's going on here, kid? A qualifying match? Owens? Strowman? You're getting the hell kicked out of you so Regal can put his boy Cody on the throne. He is using you. Yeah, he is using me to main event SummerSlam, Miz. I'm cool with it. Whatever. I'm done with both of you. You cannot get away with stealing the WWE Universal Championship from SmackDown, Regal. I believe I just have. <laughs> I love how that's just how it ends. <laughs> it's a real life Cinderella story as Cody Rhodes faces the dark horse of the tournament, Brendan Collins, for the undisputed WWE Universal title in the main event of SummerSlam right now. All right, Cody, let's tear down the house, brother. Let's go. Oh, big weave from Cody Rhodes already. We starting off hot. Oh, Cody with a big punch right to start this match off. All right, all right. This is for the WWE Undisputed Universal Championship, and Cody Rhodes is starting out hot in the driver's seat. Dude, I love how quick we're getting in to the My Rise. Like, we're already fighting for the Undisputed Universal Championship. That's crazy. But we're just getting right into the action, and I love it. Speaking of getting right into the action, Cody Rhodes with a big moonsault to start out. He's trying to finish his story right now, but so am I. I've been on the main roster for two years, and it's finally time for my opportunity, Cody. Attack Cody Rhodes to get the momentum. Oh, we gonna do that for sure. This is my version of the three amigos right here. That's two. Oh, Cody's already up. Cody got up before I did. What the hell? Let's go. Oh, I was too early on that. Cody had it scouted. Cody wants me up on my feet. Big counter. Let's go. Whip Cody into the upper right corner. All right, I can do that. Okay, we got him in the upper right corner. What you want me to do? Hit Cody Rose with a grab in the upper right corner. There we go. We got there. Yeah, no, no. Ref, ref, let me have this, man. This match means more to me than you know. Oh, Cody with a counter. Oh, I got the counter. Oh, snap. Shenanigans. Ref is down. Crossroads, and he got all of it. Oh, my God. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Shenanigans, baby. Cody is begging the ref to get up right now. Let's go. Oh, Spear! Where the hell did Roman come from? What the hell? I thought this man was shooting a movie. That's why he was doing so much talking online. Let's go, dude. You know, Roman, thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, <laughs> let's go. Hey, hey, you know what? You know what? I got no complaints. <laughs> I acknowledge you, brother. One, two, new champ, baby. Roman, thank you, brother. Thank you. I acknowledge you, my tribal chief. <laughs> let's go, dude. In the first episode, we already won the undisputed universal championship. Cody. I got mad love for you. Mad respect. Sucks to suck. New champ, baby. <laughs> that is what I'm talking about. Look at that. Ain't it beautiful? Ain't it beautiful? We about to have a beautiful reign. Yes, sir. Sorry, Cody. <laughs> the longest reigning champion of the modern era promised that Cody Rhodes would not win the title at SummerSlam, and Roman Reigns kept his word. But after the controversial conclusion, GM William Regal has promised to settle the question in the ring. Cody versus Brandon kicking off Raw tonight. Look at these clowns dancing for the head of the table scraps. Tell whoever wins I left some polish in my locker. Keep my belt nice and shiny. Roman doing a lot of yapping, dude. Oh, Cody dripped out in the suit? Who else we got? William Regal? I want to talk to Regal first. It is an absolute crime the position that Roman Reigns has put you in. The cloud now hanging over your reign as WWE Universal Champion belies your efforts. I know you fought like hell to win the title. What you're saying is not wrong, but I'm still the champ, so I'll take it. You're damn right I did. I had to compete in an extra match too, and I still made it to the finals and won. A fine achievement that the WWE Universe nonetheless 
looks askance at. Unfortunately, Reigns beat Cody as much as you did, perhaps more. I'm ready to prove myself. I don't care how it happened. I'm still the champ and I'm gonna hold this title for a minute. People think Cody would have won? Great. Tonight, we face each other again, one on one. I am ready to prove to you and the WWE Universe that I deserve to carry the title. Good lad. You can't let the world define you. You have to define yourself. And now, I'm going to define myself as the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Yes, sir. Love to hear it. Now, if you'll excuse me, it's a very busy night with the draft starting. Good luck. What up, Cody? What's popping? And the draft started tonight? That's fire. Cody, man, I was going to give you a call, but figured we should talk in person. I don't blame you. I know you and Reigns weren't in on it together. He was trying to hurt me, not help you. See, Cody, this is why I respect you. You know it wasn't personal. I appreciate that. At the same time, we both know I had you beat when Reigns attacked me from behind. All right, fair. I could have kicked out, though. One, two, three four five and that's when i got up to check on the ref hey man i was only not kicking out just to save energy because i knew the ref was down i don't need to recap i was there and i have the championship to prove it you're getting sassy now you took the crossroads it was over look you hung tough your time will come but last night you were done tonight's a different story maybe so but that was last night tonight's a different story how so we'd never fought before tonight I know you. Oh, I know the moves now. I'm familiar with you now. That works both ways. No, I mean, I know you. That little panicked freeze you get every time you're under pressure, that worry you're not measuring up to your legacy, that you'll never finish the story. Man, you're not fighting me. You're fighting you. Yo, yo, that's a crazy line. Wow. Turns out it's gonna feel pretty good making you a one night champion with an asterisk by his name. Can you win a title somebody doesn't hand you, Cody? See you out there. In addition to tonight's huge SummerSlam rematch opening the show, the WWE Draft kicks off on Raw. What a packed night. Why is no one talking about how it's a travesty that SmackDown doesn't have a champion? Working hard to address this soon. Oh, it's getting spicy and we ain't done yet. Let's go to the match. All right, Cody, let's get it popping. Rematch from SummerSlam, baby. No shenanigans this time. Oh, this man already going for that? Yo, a disaster kick to start the match off. I tried to run away, but it didn't really work. Execute a grab on Cody. Okay, there we go. Grab has been executed. Collar and elbow tie up between Cody and I. Stop the damn match. What? I Miz. said stop this unsanctioned match. Miz, come on, dude. Right. I'm so sorry to ruin his lordship's plan, but Raw's Royal General Manager, William Regal, seems to have forgotten something. Regal forgot that I had the first pick in the draft. So this conspiracy to steal the undisputed WWE Universal Championship for Raw ends tonight. The WWE Universal Champion has been drafted to SmackDown. Effective immediately wow come on get out of the ring and grab your bags it's time to go to your new home cheer up Rhodes I'm sure Regal will give you another chance at the world heavyweight championship wow can he do that speak of the devil have a look Regal all the eyes are dotted and all the T's are crossed that's what I thought now tell my WWE Universal Champion to get out of that ring and pack his bags. I'm afraid Mr. Mazanin is correct. Wow. This rematch is canceled. No way. And the undisputed WWE Universal Champion is bound for SmackDown. Wow, Cody got screwed again. You know, Miz, you could have just let the match go and whoever wins goes to SmackDown. I was not expecting that. I just said no shenanigans. I'm sorry, Cody. I wanted to give you your match. Hey, but your boy's still the champ. Keep that in mind. Your boy's still the champ. <laughs> We're here on SmackDown. Who's going to be my first opponent? Who's going to be my first rivalry? I'm cool with the blue brand. I got no complaints about being on SmackDown. It's just how it happened. The Dark Horse story has been completed. What up, Miz? Miz. Good to see you too, champ. Come on. What's with the boo-boo face? when I'm the one who liberated you from his lordship. I didn't need liberating. Let's skip the pleasantries. You wanted a WWE Universal Champion on SmackDown. 
Here I am. What I wanted is the undisputed WWE Universal Championship. The champion can be anyone who understands what it means to represent the most must-see sports entertainment show on earth. You think you're that guy? You made the right call, but you didn't have to do it the way you did it. If you're looking for must-see, turns out you made the right call. I've been waiting for the chance to show the WWE Universe what I am. And whether it's SmackDown or Raw makes no difference to me. Much to my surprise, I dig your attitude. Maybe Regal hasn't ruined you. But if you think you're must-see, let's find out when you defend that WWE Universal Championship against Kevin Owens. Okay. I'll beat KO again. I beat KO in the tournament, and I will gladly beat him again. Excellent. And just a heads up, I might come see your match in person. You know, just an impartial observer to get a closer look at the champion I drafted. Whatever. Absolutely no other reason at all. See you out there. This man cannot be trusted. We already got another WWE Universal Championship match, and this time it's against Kevin Owens. Why is everybody doing that? Everybody trying to do springboards to start the match. Just have a match with me, bro. I, I also thought the Miz was going to be ringside, but he hasn't shown up yet. Um, Not that I'm complaining about that. Really? You're going to do that again? You're going to do that again? We already got that. Roll through. Double knees to the face. Uh-oh. Here comes the Miz. Here comes the Miz. Miz, I don't really like your strategy, man. Kevin about to try and roll me up, huh? Watch him try and hit me with a finisher or roll me up. Okay. Yep. Oh, wait. Surprise Kevin with the leverage pin. I, I got one of my own. Let's go. Leverage pin. Oh, snap. Yo, Jessica counted that fast. This man grabbed the steel chair. Are you serious? We're going to stop that right now. Uh-uh. Kevin, just go to the back. You lost your match. Keep it pushing. Let's go. I'm not afraid to hit you with a chair, Kevin. I may be a good guy, but I'll hit you with a weapon. I don't care. The Miz is really plotting right now. And speaking of plotting, this man's setting up a table. Miz, I will send you through that table. Don't play with me. Oh, Kevin. Kevin, you about to catch a mean powerbomb through this table. Let's go. Kevin Owens just got put through a table. Let's go. Stop playing with me. Give me my title. Let's go. The Spartan is not putting up with the BS right now. That's what I'm talking about. Yo, Kevin Owens. <laughs> Somebody check on him. <laughs> after assaulting Kevin Owens after their WWE Universal title match on SmackDown, The Miz has promised serious consequences for Brandon. It's your fault. Listen to y'all talking about this chump barely winning his first defense on day one. I held the WWE Universal title for so long that I had nothing left to prove. Call me if Brandon makes it through 30 days. Roman. Roman, you pissing me off now. You may have helped me with the title, but you talking a lot of trash. What the hell, Miz? Impartial observer? You were passing chairs, setting up tables. I'm surprised you didn't chuck a ladder at me for good measure. Turns out the situation called for a partial observer. It's what's best for the image of the brand. And that would be Kevin Owens? What does he have that I don't? KO's exciting, unpredictable. Yeah, he's a little rough around the edges, but Maurice has her stylist working on a makeover, and there's this amazing jacket being tailored. Look, the point is, KO has promised to be The Miz's undisputed WWE Universal Champion, and that's what matters. Believing a word KO tells you is your first mistake, and more importantly, of beating your poster boy. Twice now. Beating him with a chair. Put him through a table. You mentioned a ladder earlier. Well, let's go there. At Clash at the Castle, you will put the WWE Universal title on the line against KO in a TLC match. Wow. Fine. I'm going to walk into that match with my title, and I'll walk out with it, too. No, no, no. You will not walk in with the WWE Universal title because it will be hanging high above the ring, right where it belongs. Out of your reach. In a TLC match? Bro, Kevin Owens got rolled up twice. He doesn't even deserve this opportunity. A lot's changed since the last time we spoke in an empty arena. Indeed. That night I gave you an opportunity and you took full advantage. I guess. Most everyone in the WWE Universe thinks Roman Reigns won me the title and KO only beat himself to get me there. There will always be doubters. Every WWE Universal Champion will be in the shadow of Roman Reigns in one way or another. At least until someone can break the record with the title. Well, that's pretty much an impossible goal. 
Perhaps. My point is that you should take it a step at a time. You'll be the dark horse until one day you turn around and someone calls you the favorite. I'll just have to keep winning. I think that might be a ways off. I'll just have to keep winning. A dominant victory over Owens tonight will go a long way towards answering that question in SmackDown's locker room, if not with its general manager. Miz can be a real tosser. <laughs> Quite right. But it seems to me that he has also given you an opportunity to prove he and the doubters wrong. That's what being a champion is, huh? Constant battle to prove you deserve your spot at the top of the card. Indeed it is, my boy. Indeed it is. And that's exactly what we're about to do in this TLC match. Let's get it popping. All right, Kevin, this better be your last opportunity. He really just dodged me like that. Y'all saw that? What is this man grabbing? This man grabbing a ladder already. But yeah, let me just grab that. Sit your ass down, Kevin. Come on now. What was the plan there? Oh, Kevin, you're a funny man. You got rolled up twice. Now you're about to lose in a TLC match. This is going to be fun. Let's go. Oh, snap. All right, I did too much talking. I did too much talking. The Miz is really doing everything in his power to make sure Kevin Owens wins. Yeah, you grab that chair. I'm going to do a little springboard. Poison Rana. Sit your ass down, Kevin. I'm going to grab this table. Thank you very much. Just going to slide that in the ring. We're going to have a little bit of fun before I start climbing. You're grabbing another ladder? Oh, my God. Kevin, you're insane. <laughs> you're actually crazy. Oh, no, that's not what I was trying to do. Not what I was trying to do. Oh, nice counter. Oh, it was right there. Please don't put me through that table. Really? My feet went through. <laughs> That's crazy. The crowd is already chanting. This is awesome. Do not throw that. D I knew it. I had a feeling he was going to throw that at me. Come on. <laughs> Where are you going? Where are you going, Kevin? You know what? You take your sweet time with that. I'm just going to put this here. We're going to start the climb, but I'm going up for my championship. Oh, uh oh, uh oh. There he goes. Ah, oh, okay. He pushed down the ladder and a power bomb. Chill with this chair, bro. Really? Let me get up first, Kevin. Damn. Oh no! Stutter! Oh shit. Ah. Oh, ah. Oh, oh. Oh. Never mind. Thought you were gonna try and climb, buddy. You're not being very smart here. Let's go. Big counter. We're going back and forth. You're going through this ladder, Kevin. Let's make a moment, Kevin. At your expense, though. Let's go. We got him up. Let's go. From the top. Big senton. Kevin's out. Kevin is out. There we go. Ladder is in a good spot now. Yeah, yeah. You, you chill right there. Neogl what the hell? I call shenanigans. Please get up. Please get up. Get out of the corner. Get out of the corner. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Kevin's goofing anyway. Let's go. Let's go. Get him down. Get him down. Yank him. Yank him. Oh, I'll take it. Power bomb instead. Let's go. Oh, he's up. He's up. Super kick. He ran right into it. Near glory. Climb. Climb, Brandon. Climb. Hurry. We got one. Oh, no. It's going so fast. It's going so fast. No. It's going so fast. No. Power bomb on the ladder. That was difficult. That was difficult. Come on. Get up. Get up. Roll through. Let's go. No, no, no. We're about to send this man out of here. Let's go. Get out of my ring. Get out of my ring. Climb, Brandon. Climb. Hurry. Kevin taking a sweet time. Oh, my God. It's going so fast. Let's go. We have retained the WWE Undisputed Universal Championship. That has got to be it for Kevin. Back of the line, pal. Oh, the story already complete. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Troy Simpkin. Justine. And Tavish? We're talking to Tavish. Hello, champ. I hope you'll forgive an old timer but in your business. But it seems you've got yourself an Irish storm brewing. Seamus has been telling everyone your reign is about finished. Now, my fighting days may be behind me, but there's no way I'd let a comment like that stand. I reckon you show that Irish warrior you're not close to finished in a finisher match. You know what? I accept. Let's do it. Hey, this should be a fun one. A finisher match? I don't mind a little stipulation. And it's not for the title, too. It's, it's going to be nice not having to worry about losing my championship. <laughs> Let's go. Big DDT did not land. I like the fast-paced action of this one. Seamus, where are you going? Seamus. Seamus, can he use that? Can he? I, I'm going to let him hit me. So we can use weapons? Say less. That's all I needed to know. Get off me. 
Back up. We got Rage. Watch, watch. Finisher match. What up, Seamus? What up, Seamus? Hey, oh, he saw it coming. I was going for the Nia Glory. He shut it down. Oh, big punch. We up. Nia Glory. Curtains. Curtains for Seamus. <laughs> that was a fun little match. That was fun. And we got 10 upgrade points for that. Thanks, Tavish. All right, Troy, what's popping? Troy. What's Mizanin got on the docket for me now? Miz has the biggest spectacular celebration in television history planned for the new undisputed WWE Universal Champion. I don't like this. Seriously? Seriously, Pyro, a marching band, miniature versions of those giant beer horses. Interesting. Uh, you mean Clydesdales? Sure. Anyway, all that a balloon drop, and finally, the presentation of the championship. You head out to your mark, and we'll get the show going. Listen, I'm new around here, but I'm not sure the best way for me to ingratiate myself to a new locker room is to have a huge celebration of me. Why not? It could be fun. Your call. Just say the word, and Miz is ready to celebrate your arrival in style. Let's make it happen. I want to see what's going on. I normally don't attend the celebrations without cake, but in this case, you're on. Let's make it happen, Troy. You head out to the ring, and I'll get everything going. Miz is going to love this. I definitely know shenanigans are about to go down, but I'm so curious. <laughs> oh my God, somebody's about to ambush me. Who, is that Theory? Yo, what's your deal? Yo, Charles, get him off me, bro. Yo, we're both from Atlanta. We're supposed to be holding each other accountable. Hold each other down. Adam Pierce, you're not even the GM. Get Austin Theory off of me, dude. Austin trying to make a name for himself right now. What happened to my celebration? I want Austin Theory, and I want him now. I know you're upset, but... Upset? No. I am angry, Troy. That thirsty attention seeker jumped me from behind, and now I'm gonna give him some attention he really won't like in the form of a receipt. You wanna talk about receipts? I have a pile of actual receipts for everything we paid for and didn't get to use. Do you have any idea how much we sunk into the WWE Universal Championship celebration? All for nothing, Miz might fire me. You can still use it. <laughs> it's a new week, buddy. Troy, I don't care. In fact, the only thing I do care about is wringing Austin Theory's neck. So you go see if Miz is gonna send you packing. But first, you tell him I'm fighting Theory tonight, sanctioned or otherwise. After a vicious attack on the new WWE Undisputed Universal Champion, Brandon Collins, the champ, has demanded a match with Theory. The only person who makes demands on SmackDown is me, but Undisputed WWE Universal Champion Austin Theory has an awesome ring to it. Brandon wants to shorten his reign, more power to him. The match is on. Yo, The Miz is riding hard, bro. Austin, I am not about to take it easy on you, man. I want revenge for what you did last week. You ruined my celebration. We're starting off strong here tonight. Oh, dodged? Come on now, stop playing with me. And you caught a Rip Courtney to the face. I'm about to make light work of Austin Theory here on SmackDown. Yes, sir. To the ropes we go. Sling Blade. Oh, never mind. Theory with the big German suplex. I was not expecting that. All right, we're going to the outside. Wow. Theory followed up immediately. All right, now Theory's in control. Now he's in the driver's seat. Austin Theory looking to make a statement here on SmackDown against the Spartan. It's not going to happen right now. Get your ass back in there. Let's go. Kick him. Oh, let's go. Standing Spanish fly into the cover. Hook of the leg. One. Two. Oh, Theory with the kick out from the top, bro. I got another Spanish fly for you, big dog. Let's go. Something that'll put you away, Theory. Oh, he's already back up. He already back up. Yo. Chill on me, Theory. Power bomb. Austin is cooking now. Uh-oh. Theory. Oh, okay. I see you. Okay, no. I tried to reverse it. I was too late. That was clean, though. I can't even lie. I can't even lie. Big super. Big super. Let's go. Nia Glory. We finna retain this championship, baby. Oh, he kicked out. I actually can't believe that. All right. It's time, baby. Buckshot. It lands. That's it. That's it. Thanks for coming. Let's go. Buckshot for the win. Austin Theory is not walking out as your champ. Absolutely not.
Well, 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 all hail the conquering hero. What's got you so excited? Other than I finally got that promotion to producer, probably the fact that your stock is on the rise too. The response to your TLC match with KO was off the charts and you've been on a roll ever since. I know my boss Miz has been taking notice. Okay, so what do you and Miz have for me tonight? Network sweeps are coming up, so we need to pop a big rating. And with your newfound popularity around the office, Miz has something very special planned for his undisputed WWE Universal Champion. That is the kind of cryptic answer that makes me uneasy. And when I'm uneasy, I get on edge. And when I'm on edge, that makes me want to go out there and create some chaos. Do you want me to create some chaos, Troy? Yes! That's exactly the kind of programming we want during sweeps. So head out to the ring, and we'll get to see how your chaos and Mrs. Big Surprise play out. All right, I'll head to the ring. Troy, I will head to the ring, and I don't care what Miz has up his sleeve. I'm going to tell your boss exactly what I think of him and his big plan for sweeps. Great! Sounds like rating. What is going on here? Oh, it's promo time, baby. I haven't been on SmackDown very long, but if there's one thing I've learned, it's that when our GM has a must-see announcement, it's generally bad news for me. So Miz, I'm not gonna sit back and wait for you to try to pull one over on me. Whatever big surprise you have planned, I'm ready for it. Right now. I don't trust this. Do Someone's gonna run up from behind me. Freaking Randy Orton. Bro? Pain? What the hell? That is the last person I was expecting. Kane, chill on me. Chill on me, Kane. No! Oh, oh, I thought he was about to hit that choke slam. Oh, all right, bad, 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 bad. I like this plan. I thought he was gonna run away. Sit down. Oh, never mind, never mind. Roll through. You goofed. Let's go. Pick up the chair. Let's go. Hit him. Let's go. What you want with this Kane? Bam! <laughs> and I threw it at his head. Irish whip Kane to the aisle side of the ring. Say less. Get out of here. There we go. Where did Oh Jesus Christ? Where did Kane come from, dude? Do not choke slam me on the steps. Please reverse this. Please. Oh no! Oh my god, dude. The way he snapped back off of that. Oh my lord. Do not. Do not, do not put your grubby mitts on that. Yeah, that's what I thought. I do not approve of this. Why would the Miz do this to me? Miz is a top tier hater. Oh, what up Lita? Hey, hope you're doing okay. I know we only met that one time at the Mania after party, but I was watching SmackDown and saw my dear ex-husband Kane is back and coming for your title. I know the guy better than anyone who's lived to tell the tale. So if you want some friendly advice, let me know. I mean, we can text about other things. What up Dom Dom? Uh, hey Dom, what's up? I know things started out rough between us going for the WWE Universal title. It was dog eat dog. But I get it, because it was just like that in the yard back when I was in the joint. Oh, brother. <laughs> I, uh, sure thing, man. Water under the bridge. This thing Miz has going on with you and Kane, it ain't right. But I think I might know a way you can take care of that big red freak. I am definitely open to some advice. Especially since I hear Miz is going to announce a title match against Kane. Glad you're willing to listen, but not here. Miz has got stooges creeping everywhere. You want my help with Kane? Meet me out in the parking lot. Bro, nothing ever goes right in the parking lot of WWE. I'm just gonna say that now. I'll keep that in mind. Lita actually offered to help me out too. Seems like you gotta make a choice then. Get help from Kane's old flame or fight fire with real fire. Me. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I wanna go with Dom. <laughs> and it's also because I'm wearing this shirt. Shout out Tom and Nick. <laughs> All right, I'm in. I'll see you in the parking lot after the show. Not if I see you first. Don't make this weird. I feel an ambush. I just feel like an ambush is about to happen. Stop! See, I shouldn't have trusted you, man. I shouldn't have trusted you. I should have just went with Lita. I, I knew he was scummy, man. This is BS, man. Fight Dominic over to the bottom of the ramp. Man, dirty Dom. 
Damn, son. Why are you trying to break my jaw? Because you jumped me in a parking lot. I thought I was meeting you out here to talk. Man, I wasn't jumping you. This is how we do it in maximum security. You gotta jump the new fish into the gang. Maximum security, you were in jail for like a day. Don't worry about all that. All that matters now is we're brothers. Whatever. Dom. It's gonna <laughs> take the same thing to take out a monster like Kane. Becoming his brother? I think he already has one. Nah, prison rules. One of my boys, he can get me a discount on a taser. A taser? That's right, Kane's gonna get got when he least expects it. I'm not so sure this is the way to go. Nah, we're brothers for life. Remember, I got you, dog. <laughs> prison rules! <laughs> what Wait, the hell? Dom, seriously? Yo, Dom is a different kind of breed, bro. <laughs> Rumors are swirling that Brandon is turning to unorthodox methods in training for his WWE Universal title defense against Kane on SmackDown. No measures, however desperate they may be, are going to be enough for Brandon to prepare because I'm making this a casket match. Are you serious? Tune into SmackDown for Brandon's final burial. Don't sweat this casket match stuff. I got you, bro. With my help, you're gonna bury Kane. Prison rules. By the way, the taser has been acquired. I'm gonna need that. When are you gonna get it to me? Don't worry, I got this handled. Dom, I'm trusting you, man. Please, don't make me regret this. I cannot believe that we're fighting Kane in a casket match on SmackDown. <laughs> Not even on pay-per-view. Springboard, let's go. Neckbreaker to take down Kane. Attempt to grab Kane. Okay, we grabbed him now. Uh-oh. See, this is the, the weight problem here. Uh-oh. Kane with a big choke slam. Somebody please make the save. Yo, where's Dirty Dom? Dom, where's the taser? Kane, you could go open the casket first. You don't have to drag me like that, Kane. Come on. Oh, Dom, let's go. Let's go. Dom, that's what I'm talking about. I wasn't expecting him to be in the casket. I'm not going to lie. Dom turning face out here. Yo, Brandon, get up. Yo, turn that taser off. Oh, my God. Dom, Dom, you might want to turn around. Dom, you might want to turn around. Dom, not like this. Not like this. Oh, he's going to tase Dominic. No, Dom. Yo, he's going to kill him. Jesus Christ. Let's go, chop block. Dom, I'm sorry that happened to you. <laughs> this man's crawling out of here in so much pain. Oh, the taser's gone. I wanted to use the taser. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Oh, he threw me in. Uh-oh, this is not good. This is not good. Right back. Absolutely not. Do enough damage for that, Kane. What are you grabbing? This man grabbing a bat? What are you planning on doing with that? Nope. What are you planning on doing with that, Kane? Since you all big and bad, let's go. And another one. I missed. And never mind. I thought I had that. Put me down. Put me down. Put me down. Not like that. Not like that. Oh, damn. Wow. I haven't seen that animation yet. Oh, we already getting back up. Let's go. Let's go. Crawl out. What are you grabbing now? Oh, he got a chair. But I got a bat. Let's see what's more powerful. Oh, we had the same idea. We had the exact same idea. I was just a little too fast for him. Here we go. Let's go, buckshot. Let's go. That's gotta be it. That has got to be it. Bada bing, bada boom. Let's go ahead and end this match. Are you serious? How's he fighting back still? Jesus. Kane, let me have this. Let's go. Oh, I missed. I missed, I goofed. Oh, bruh, bruh. All right, I'm trash, I'm trash. I'm trash. Kane, you don't want to do this. You don't want to hit me with a tombstone. You don't want to. You didn't want to do that. <laughs> we up. <laughs> Come on. Come on. His old ass. His old ass. No soul in the tombstone. Let's go. <laughs> I'm not losing my championship. You got me messed up. Let's put him in the casket. Close it. Close it. That's got to be it. That's got to be it. Are you serious? Close the casket. Close it. Let's go. Finally. Oh my lord, Kane put up a fight. But at the end of the day, it did not matter because and still your WWE Undisputed Universal Champion, the Spartan, Brandon Collins. What's happening? Look who it is. Congratulations. The Dark Horse manages to win another race. And I didn't even have to win it for you this time. Did you forget? 
You're only standing there because of me. The locker room hasn't forgotten. The WWE Universe hasn't. And they won't. You can hold my WWE Universal title for a year. Two years. Why not three? It doesn't matter. You're just a tenant. I'm the landlord. You're holding something that doesn't belong to you because its owner has other interests. For now. Later, Chip. Oh, whatever, Roman, whatever. You may have helped me win this title, but I guarantee you when the time comes, when it's me and you one-on-one, -on -one, this championship is staying with me. A taser? Seriously? What is this, 1998 WCW? Ah! Don't have Kane come after me and I won't have to use a taser. Let's be real. You were the one who brought in the literal undead demon to fight me as a rating stunt. I think a little fighting fire with fire was justified. Well, it was embarrassing for the brand. Your big moment of triumph ended with Roman Reigns burying my champion deeper than you buried Kane. Then maybe Roman ought to come back and try his luck. I would love that. Roman is must-see. The only must-see thing about you is the target on your back. I'm the undisputed WWE Universal Champion, Miz. There's always a target on my back. Yeah, there is. Everyone in that locker room is circling you like sharks because they can taste the blood in the water. Roman's right. You're just champion. For now. I guess we'll find out, boss. See you next week. Miz, man. I, I've said it in the past couple episodes. Miz is a top-tier hater. What happened? Did I get him? Did we win? Yes, Dom. We won. See? What did I say? Bros for life. Dom and I are bros for life. Let's go. Shout out Dom, man. I've been champ for 362 days. And after all was said and done, Becky Lynch won the WWE Women's Championship. The man is once again the man, and the WWE Universe could not be happier. The same can't be said on Raw, where the World Heavyweight Championship has been moving around like a hot potato. Well, uh -oh. if you want championship consistency, look no further than SmackDown. General Manager The Miz has been obsessed with the Throning the WWE Universal Champion, but the man many call the Dark Horse has now become the workhorse, turning back every challenge. If he successfully defends the title against Drew McIntyre in a Falls Count Anywhere match at SummerSlam, he will have been champion for a full year. Yo, we've been champ for a year already? That's crazy. We better retain. That's all I got to say. All right, it is Brandon Collins versus Drew McIntyre for the WWE Undisputed Universal Championship. And Drew McIntyre is not wasting any time. Oh my God, I'm getting stomped out by the Scottish Warrior. If Brandon Collins retains here at SummerSlam, he will have held this championship for one year in total. I'm gonna tell you right now, we are gonna retain Drew. Oh, Drew giving me the combos, the Reese's Pieces. I can't do nothing. Oh, there we go. We got the counter. We got the reversal. There's a false count anywhere match. I'm excited about that. We get to use weapons. We get to do whatever we want to do. But Drew McIntyre is shutting it down. Oh, this man going to the outside. He's looking for a weapon. What did he grab? He's grabbing a chair. He's just going to drop it. I don't know what that was about. Springboard. He got caught, buddy, from the ropes. Oh, not even a count of one. That's crazy, bro. Quick kick out, but give him a kiss. Drew, you don't, you don't want to go for the Claymore. Please, no. Let's go. Big counter. Get on your feet. Knee of glory. Let's go. Oh, but Drew got the shoulder up. Okay. Now we're cooking. All right, let's send him out here. Bam. I'm following Sue. It's false count anywhere. We're about to get crazy in this arena. Can I not do some redecorating? Oh, Drew. Drew with the possum. Oh, only going to be a count of one. Only going to be a count of one. Drew McIntyre is not playing around right now. He's got me in a powerbomb situation here. Oh, my God. A powerbomb on the apron. Jesus. This match can end right here, right now. And that's exactly what Drew McIntyre is looking to do. But he got caught. He got caught. Big forearm. Turn around. No. I ran right into it. Oh, let's go. Reversal from your boy. There's no way. Give him a kiss. Not again. That's two Glasgow kisses. No, no, I got to use resiliency. I got to use resiliency. You're not going to hit me with that kendo stick. Yeah, you tried it, buddy. Try again. Give me that. Give me that kendo stick. Let's go. Big neck breaker. No, no, no. This is mine now. This is mine now. Since you want to hit me with that on the outside, I got some. Oh, my God. Claymore. No. You got to be kidding me. A Claymore out of nowhere. 
Dude, that was crazy. Run it back. Bam. Kick to the knee. Knee of glory. That's a wrap. If he kicks out, I'm going to be so pissed. Let's go. All right. We got the win. We retained the championship. I definitely did not lose at any point. <laughs> 365 days that's what i'm talking about with the SummerSlam victory tonight the dark horse has ridden tall for a year all hail bde our universal champion that's what i'm talking about give me a break how this tomato can has held on to my wwe universal title for a year is one of life's greatest mysteries roman learn how to type <laughs> the miss. if you told me a year ago that you would still be wwe universal champion I wouldn't have believed it. I am delighted to disappoint you. Am I disappointed? You're a draw. For some reason, people seem to like you. It's just that damn insistence on doing the exact opposite of everything I say that drives me nuts. I've never been great with authority. How long are we gonna keep doing this? I am the most must-see general manager in SmackDown's history. You're the WWE Universal Champion with all the momentum. So what if we work together instead of being at each other's throats? Because this right now, this feels like yet another trap you're trying to spring. I don't trust you. Call it a choice between the carrot and the stick. The carrot is, I make you into a cross-platform superstar like WWE has never seen. Of course, you'll need to have a bit of an attitude change and be willing to get your hands dirty. Okay, and what's the stick? The stick is, reject my offer, and if you think it's been a hard year, you can't even imagine what's coming next. After what I'll put you through, you will never escape Roman's shadow. Interesting. Maybe that's exactly what I do. Escape his shadow and yours too. What the hell does that mean? What it means is I hear NXT is a really cool brand. Never been. Maybe I take the undisputed WWE Universal Championship, head down to NXT and go after the title that Roman never won. What? You have a contract. You can't just walk off my show. I don't know. After this past year, I think I've shown I can do just about whatever I want. Fine. You have a choice to make. Work with me and have everything you've ever dreamed of. Or I make you regret ever becoming a WWE superstar. Listen, listen, listen. I don't want to team with The Miz, but I really don't want to go to NXT. No shade to NXT. That's just not where I'm trying to go right now. Your boy is the top dog on SmackDown. I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna team with the Miz. You know what, Miz? You're a devious SOB. And maybe that's a side of myself I need to tap into to get out of Roman's shadow. Let's do it. Yes! That is what I'm talking about. I knew you had ambition. We are going to rule the galaxy and everything beyond. If you say so. The point is, I have big plans for you. You're about to become a major crossover star. Tell me something. Do you like video games? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, I do. I'm playing one right now. The Monsters Among Men story has been completed. What up, Woods? Hold up. Our truth And Slade. Oh my God. I'm definitely not talking to this jabroni. You had your chance last year, buddy. I want to talk to Woods. Champ, I've been looking for you. Woods. Yeah, I saw your text. Sorry, Miz has me super busy with a bunch of uh, champ stuff. You know how it is. I mean, or at least you know how half of it is, because you were a tag champ. I'm going to ignore that for now, because what <laughs> I wanted to talk to you about is that you are stealing from me. Stealing? What? Don't play dumb with me. I'm talking about the show. The video game show? Look, it's totally different than yours. What's my show called? Up, Up, Down, Down. And what is your show going to be called? It's, well, Down, Up, Down, Up. Yo. That's the same show. You and Miz stole my IP and barely even had the decency to change the name. Uh, we don't even spell the name out. It's with arrows. With arrows? Are you kidding me? You need to relax. Down, Up, Down, Up, but with arrows. Hasn't even premiered yet. Miz is still looking for my co-host. How are you going to judge before we even start? <laughs> because this is plagiarism. I've spent years building this show and brand and you just step in and rip it off? You and me are gonna have to sort this out. <laughs> we'll deal with this, Woods. Woods, we'll deal with this. But I am the undisputed WWE Universal Champion in the face of SmackDown. So we'll talk sometime after my next match. 
Oh, you'll be able to slot me into all your champ stuff? We'll see. A down up, down up arena? Hell yeah, I'm down up. <laughs> they really did just rip his name, bro. <laughs> down up is crazy. <laughs> I'm facing Butch for the title? Why is this a title match? I'm wondering if shenanigans are going to be happening in this match because this is so random. Why am I putting my championship on the line against Pete Dunne? Not against Pete Dunne. I think Pete Dunne is dope, but um, I, I just don't trust this. So am I a heel now? Like, what, what's going on? Am I actually teaming up with The Miz? I don't know what's happening. Let's go. Big rolls. Let's go. Double knees to the face. That was clean. I don't know if uh, if Pete Dunn can do anything to stop your boy right now, but we're going to go after the phalanges. Oh, here we go. What the hell is this? Up, up, down, down. Woods, where you at? Shenanigans. I had a feeling. Pete, you don't want this. You don't want this, Pete. All right. All right. Get off me, man. Get off me. Are you, are you working with uh, Xavier Woods, Pete? I don't think he's going to kick. All right. All right, it didn't want to work. The, the running near glory didn't want to work, but we got it anyway. Really? Really? That didn't work? Uh-oh. This is the finish, ain't it? Oh, no, there wasn't a second reversal for the title. <laughs> the bar was huge. Let's go. Bam. It's about that time, Pete Dunn. You're right where I want you. Let's go. Frog Splash lands for the win. Hook of the leg to retain the title. The Spartan does it. Let's go, baby. That was it. I was expecting a cutscene after this. Woods trying to play mind games with me, but it ain't working. And why is every match for my damn title? If Brendan thought that was distracting, he should just wait. Up, up, down, down isn't going anywhere. And neither am I. I mean, it was barely distracting. The Dark Horse is out there playing games while I continue to dominate in real life. Yo, Gunther, if you got a problem, come see your boy. With his new alliance with Miz, has Brandon sold out? Nah, your boy bought in, all right? Brandon hasn't sold out. He bought in, exactly. See, me, me and Miz right there. All right, Miz, this, this might not be too bad. Now that we're on the same page, Big changes are coming to SmackDown. All right, me, me and Miz, we here. You might be all right. The champ is here. Ooh, isn't that a little uh, played out? You're right. I'll get Troy to focus test some new catchphrases for my guy. But either way, you are about to be the most must-see crossover superstar in SmackDown history. Which, believe me, I am stoked for. By the way, how about Xavier Woods getting hot about all this? He's saying we stole his show. We did steal his show. That's insane. Our show is totally different. You and your superstar co-host are going to play video games and stream them live to your built-in audience of the WWE Universe. So up, up, down, down. <laughs> yeah, way different. Right? It's not even close. And you won't look like a slob the way Woods does. Marisa Stylist is putting together a whole new look just for you. Oh no, oh no. I feel like I've heard that somewhere before. Anyway, I wasn't too happy that Woods interrupted my match. Come on, you wanted to work with me. These are the repercussions of that attitude change. And besides, Woods is only generating more attention for your big premiere. You're right. Forget I said anything. Speaking of which, what are you even doing here? Your co-host is already on her way to makeup. Her? Who the hell is my co-host? Uh, oh, you cast someone? Who is it? Is it Kathy Kelly? Head to the set, champ. I don't want to ruin the surprise. When you're ready to go, I've got a car waiting. I'm intrigued. Is that Gigi? Yo, I'm dripped out. M Yo, M Maurice might know what she's doing. Welcome to the premiere episode of Down Arrow, Up Arrow, Down Arrow, Up Arrow. I think we can just say down up, down up. Sure. Presented by The Miz. Woo! I'm WWE superstar Gigi Dolan, and I was told about this like 20 minutes ago. Miz told me days ago. Did he give you a gold star too? Got it! Oh, brother. I'm joined by my co-host, the not at all controversial WWE Universal Champion. Am I that controversial? Do you read your social media or talk to anyone in the locker room? Dude, you've got heat. Point is, we are going to play an exciting video game and you will never believe what it is. 
It's WWE 2K24. <laughs> booty. I call booty. This wasn't in the rundown. Those are booty. This is booty. That that right there is especially booty. Damn. The jacket? Yeah. It's clearly a Kevin Owens hand-me-down. You swore this show wasn't a ripoff, and it is literally my show, but done much worse. We've been over this. What is your show called? I'm glad you asked. Up, up, down, down. <laughs> Available wherever you stream high quality content. Exactly. And our show is down, up, down, up. With arrows, though. Not With spelled arrows. out. That, see? Totally different. One, that is totally the same. And two, down, up, down, up isn't part of a famous video game code. It doesn't even mean anything. Let's be real. Have either of you ever played a game in your lives? Of yeah. course, all the time. And I watch your show. Not not to rip it off, just because I love games. Uh, oh my, okay. You got your controller, I brought mine. You and me, WWE 2K24, it's on. Wow, he really called you out. DJ, whose side are you on? High school? Fine, let's do it. What do you got? I'm playing as my amazing alter ego, Cast Zero. Wouldn't it be cool if he was an unlockable? <laughs> then I'll play as John freaking Cena. Playing as one me. of the highest OVR characters in the game. Hmm, bold. I mean, he has a point. You're a huge help. Who would you play as? If it were me carrying the honor of the undisputed WWE Universal Championship, I'd play as Stacked McSlex. Ooh, oh, nice. Deep cut. He's got the lowest OVR in the game. You know he's based on a real guy. I beat him once on the indies. If you can beat Zero with Stacked, that'll prove you're a real gamer and not some booty wannabe gaming poser. Xavier's words. Or take the easy way out. Go with Cena and prove nothing. Totally your call, though. Man, I know, Will. I'm going with Stacked McSlacks, baby. Stacked McSlacks. I just got to see what this dude look like. Oh, this arena is actually really cool. What? Presented by The Miz. <laughs> Stack McSlacks? Is this freaking MJF? <laughs> what the hell? Look at this Poindexter. Oh my God. I, I need some white tape. Let me put my glasses on, dude. Stack McSlacks. Look at this guy. <laughs> I should have went with John Cena. And that, that attire is clean. I can't even hold you. That zero attire is nice. I see you, Woods. I see you. All right, Woods, it's time to beat you with Mr. McSlax. <laughs> attempt to beat zero? What do you mean attempt? See, this is what 2K needs to do more often. I like when you don't have to win a match. You missed wildly, buddy. I like that if you lose, then you just lose. That should happen way more often. This man got the Apple Watch on. He's counting his steps right now. Don't mind him. Yo, please tell me that we can unlock him if we win. <laughs> please. What, bro, this man is flexing the muscles that he don't have. <laughs> to the top rope. Let's go. Oh, while he was getting up too. What's this man's signature? What is, is this a DDT? Oh, never mind. Never mind. All right, I'm cool with that. Is that gonna win us the match though? Ah, he kicked out. All right, all right. I'm gonna let Zero get up to his feet. We're gonna grab him. Oh, 10 beats, 10 beats. Let's go. Yo, Stack McSlacks is goaded. His moves set fire. <laughs> Zero can't do nothing. Oh God, oh God, wheelbarrow. Let's go. Stop it. Oh, now we're going back and forth. Oh, is this a sig? <gasps> we got it! That was a finisher! It was a finisher! Roll up! Roll up! Come on! We got it! Let's go! Off the roll up! Stack McSlacks, baby! Let's go! Big win. That, that my boy right there. That my boy. Cla clap it up for my boy. I like that little bow tie you got. <laughs> see? You see? Games are one thing, but real life is another. You know what that performance you just turned in says to me? What? You are not the least bit undisputed in either real life or a video game. I just beat you. Ooh, sick burn. You want a sick burn? Try this. 
the dark horse here, stole the WWE Universal title with help from Roman Reigns. Now he's trying to steal my show with help from The Miz. Calm down, Xavier. I'm just getting started. You are a bootleg champion with a booty show. This whole thing is booty leg. Booty okay, leg. you can stop trying to get yourself over on our show. Bye. Guys, in the interest of creating compelling content both on our show and SmackDown, I have a proposal. This is gonna be good. Champ, put your WWE Universal title on the line against Xavier. He wins. You and me walk away from down up, down up, but with arrows. I like it. And what's at stake for him? Xavier, my co-host here wins, and you give up your show, Up, Up, Down, Down, and all your complaining about our entirely original masterpiece. Thinking about it? I'll even sweeten the deal. I'll come out with you for the match. Oh, oh my. Did I walk into a rom-com? Stop shipping yourselves. Anyway, I accept your challenge. I am going to put an end to your title reign and your show. Let's do this. Oh, snap. All right, this is gonna be great. What a historic premiere episode. That's all, folks. See you next time on Down Up, Down Up, but with arrows. Wait, what just happened? <laughs> for real, she's making deals for us. What the hell? <laughs> we done stole this man's show, and now I'm about to make him get rid of his own show. It's not just a game anymore. Shout out Chris Danger. Streaming rights and the undisputed WWE Universal Championship are at stake when the Dark Horse takes on the New Day's Xavier Woods at Backlash. Xavier is bringing the WWE Universal title home tonight. Just win, Xavier, please. In retrospect, putting a real life title on the line over a video game show dispute seems like poor decision making on Brandon's part, but I'm going to look great at ringside. Seriously? This was your idea, GG. What the hell? Throw me under the bus like that. Wait, this chump is putting my real undisputed WWE Universal Championship on the line over a video game? Brandon deserves what he gets. Roman, you doing a whole lot of talking. Show up to the show, bro. Oh, here's Troy again. Champ, we need to talk. Now, I know the boys like to go into business for themselves. Get to the point, Troy. Fine. Miz is not happy. Your little ego trip with Xavier Woods is put down up, down up at risk before it even makes it to episode two. It's all under control. Is it? Because it seems like Gigi Dolan bats her eyelashes and you put all of Miz's hard work in your own breakout show in jeopardy. Not to mention the WWE Universal Championship. Did y'all not watch the show? It was Gigi's idea. I'm done with this conversation. If Miz wants to talk to me, he can come see me face to face, not send his personal stooge. True. Miz has a show to run, so he delegates communication to his highly talented team. All I know is that after all he's invested in you, you better beat Woods out there, or he might have to rethink your partnership. What part of I'm done did you not get? Bye, Troy. Let's go retain our championship. Well, Woods, sorry that you got to lose in the main event of Backlash, and I'm sorry that you got to lose your show, man. It's absolutely tragic. Get Woods on his heels? What the hell does that even mean? Does that just mean whoop his ass? <laughs> Yo, Stack, leave me alone, bruh. Yo, stop messing with me, dude. The match just started, and he already distracted me. What is this about? Where's he going? To the apron? Oh, this man climbing. Woods up on the top. Oh, I was too late. He got the splash. Into the cover. Nope. No, sir. No, sir. I'm not giving you the one count yet. I'm just going to back up. <laughs> Come on now, Woods. You had to have seen that one coming. Now it's time to get some offense in. Because Woods has been killing me, man. Let's go over the top. Wiping out Woods. I'm going to retain this championship, Woods. I hope you know that. Get Woods on his heels. Maybe this move will do it. Oh, really? I just got to kick him. Watch. On his heels. <laughs> Nail Woods with the strike. I can definitely do that. Time for a cutscene, baby. GG, what are you doing? Uh, GG and stacked. Getting at it. Yo, don't put your hands on GG. What do you think this is? How was she getting ejected? Yeah, yeah, he needs to bounce too. Get out of here. Why he put his hands on GG? I should whoop your ass. Absolutely despicable. Let's go roll through. We're going up to the top. We about to put Woods away for good. From the top rope. 
Big frog splash from the Spartan. No! What's moved? He moved! Sir, there's no way you're hitting this. There is no way you're hitting this. Oh my God, I'm all the way across the ring and he missed wildly. I was about to say, there's no way that's landing. To the corner. Let's go. Big spear. Springboard. Drop kick. We got all of it. We about to finish him right here. No, he got the counter. Springboard. Oh, he kicked me and the ref. That's okay. He didn't get it though. Big knee. We're going to pick him up. It's time to put Xavier Woods down for good. Let's go. Hook the leg to retain the title. We've done it. Goodbye to your show, Woods. Down up, down up. It's here to stay. We're having a phenomenal reign. You'll love to see it. And I'm definitely a heel now because that is my heel victory motion. <laughs> Words cannot express how devastated I am to have let my up, up, down, down viewers, well, down. Brandon was the better man at Backlash, so up, up, down, down is no more. Many thanks to all the fans, even Stack McSlacks, who tried his best, which is all a man can do. Thanks for the memories, everyone. Didn't think it'd end this way, but we had a good run. Aww. You shouldn't have been running that mouth, Woods. Did you see Stacked out there? Shout out Stack McSlacks. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you chase him out of the building. Amazing. You know, turns out Miz was right. What do you mean? When he put me with you for down up, down up, but with arrows, I figured it was some kind of rib. <laughs> with arrows is important. Thanks for the vote of confidence. Let me finish. Turns out we make a pretty good team. Listen, listen. Are we about to do mixed tag matches? I don't want to do that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we do. Is Brandon trying to riz GGO right now? But still, after the outcome of tonight's match, I kind of feel bad about getting Xavier's show canceled. Come on, this is all part of Miz's plan and it's working. And besides, we just eliminated the competition. His audience is gonna need something to watch now. And that's where we come in. I know this was all technically legal, but legal and right aren't necessarily the same thing. Believe me, I know. Well, if that isn't the beginning to a long story, maybe you could tell me all about it over dinner oh snap okay he really is trying to rizz her up right now we could do that but i was thinking of going to a late night showing of that new roman reigns movie i don't want to see it really really did you know he was the longest reigning undisputed wwe universal champion ever no gg i didn't know that nobody knew that information you are absolutely toxic ah i see what you did there okay yep Come on, I don't want to miss the previews. Let's go. Am I going on a date with Gigi Dolan? I would not do this for anyone else. I, I, I think we are. Shout out to 2K for my title and thumbnail. <laughs> are wedding bells in the future for the WWE Universal Champion, Brandon Collins? Rumors are swirling on SmackDown. Hold up, wait a minute. Wedding bells? The down up, down up story has been completed. Let's see what's next. Our truth what's up? What's up, Dark Horse? I'm glad you're here. You look like a man who would appreciate the opportunity of a lifetime. Mm. Wouldn't everybody appreciate the opportunity of a lifetime? I don't know. I haven't asked everybody. Fair enough. Okay. So what's the opportunity? This has got everything. Exotic locale, untold riches, once in a lifetime experiences, and everything is for a really important cause. Any one of those things by itself would probably be enough to say yes. Bro, get to the point. Yeah, that almost sounds too good to be true. That's because it is. Most of that stuff I just made up. <laughs> I was trying to spark your interest, but I am offering you a chance to help an important cause. All you have to do is come to SmackDown in Wisconsin a day early and do a charity match to help a great organization that helps find seeing-eyed people to care for blind dogs. You sure that's right? Usually the people are blind. <laughs> blind people and blind dogs? I guess they could bond over their shared experience, but no one's gonna know where they're going. We better get up there fast. You in? I'm, I'm more than happy to help, Truth. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure whatever this cause really is, it helps someone who needs it. An extra day of travel for a good cause? What could go wrong? Don't ask that. Oh, lots of stuff. Flat tire, you can forget to pack your underwear, could run out of gas, but we're taking the plane. I always remind the pilots to fill up, and I'm almost positive they sell underwear in Wisconsin. So I think we're good. See you there. You didn't have to actually respond with what could actually go wrong. <laughs> Sounds good, Truth. All right, snowed in, let's go. Man. The snow really coming down out there, huh? Yeah, 
So, what happened to the charity match? Don't you remember we were just talking about the snow coming down? Only an idiot would travel in this weather. None of the dogs or the people could make it. Bro! We've got SmackDown in a couple of hours, and there's only a couple of other wrestlers here. We won't even have a crowd tonight. What? I know. Troy just texted. He and Miz are stuck in Chicago. I'm not sure when they might get here. That's what I was afraid of. Sounds like we have no choice but to fall back onto the line of secession. And as the longest tenured locker room member and fifth in line to run things, <laughs> I am in acting protocol 48 and naming myself acting GM. I don't think he can do that. What are you talking about? Protocol 48? Did, did you just make that up? Yes, but as my first order of business as acting GM, I'm writing Protocol 48, which names the acting GM in charge of everything. I had a strange feeling this was going to happen when I heard Miz was stuck in Chicago. So I went ahead and pulled the locker room and everyone agreed they really wanted title shots. Well, I, I'm sure they did agree to that. I bet they did. I guess part of being in charge is saying no. Why would I say no? I can't look like I'm playing favorites on my first day on the job. I run a democratic administration <laughs> and the people have voted. Jesus Christ, truth. What? I fly in early to help you in some charity out and this is the thanks I get? Charity isn't about what you get. It's about what you give. And first up, you be giving Robert Roode a title shot. And since everyone is trying to dig their way out of the snow, it's going to be a shovels match. By the way, how do you think I'm doing so far as GM? You're doing terrible. I think this will be one of the most amazingly bad situations in the history of WWE. I stopped listening at amazing. Okay. Good luck out there, champ. Sick. Thanks, Truth. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Seems like the whole airport is pretty much shut down. I'll give you an update as soon as I have it. Hang tight and let me know if you need anything. I need a competent GM. Our truth is scheduling title defenses against everyone here. Seriously? Okay, I'm on my way. There's a group of French circus performers heading up to a college gig your way. I'm hitching a ride with them. Hopefully I'm there in a few hours. You better hurry yo ass up, Troy. Oh my God. I gotta have a shovels match in an empty arena. They really got me fighting in an empty arena for my championship against Robert Roode. Attack Robert Roode with a shovel. I could definitely do that because you about to get buried tonight, Robert. Yeah, get up. Get up with your red pants. Take that. I got to hit him again. Oh, oh, oh. He hit me with the shovel. All right. I'm the one getting buried now. Triple H will be proud. Oh, my God. All right. Sick. And you're going to taunt with it, you son of a gun. Oh, what? And he got me with a neck breaker? Yo, Robert Root snapping. I thought this was going to be a walk in the park, but I guess not. It's a big swing. Let's go. What's next? Just defeat him? All right, say less. Hey, Robert, hold that. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh, my Lord, dude. To the ropes you go. Yo, what is this glitch, man? I've noticed this. If I Irish whip somebody to the ropes, it just automatically does a sling blade. I'm going to Irish whip him to the ropes. Watch. Not going to do anything. Look, I didn't even press anything, and it just does it. I hate that. Fix it, 2K. Hold this. Oh, I'm selling like crazy. Yo, get up, man. I'm getting the shovel. Yeah, run at me if you want to. Bam. Hey, Robert. Hey, Robert. Hold that. <laughs> Let's go. Big move. Big move. Poison Rana to retain the title. Oh, okay. All right. Oh my god, oh my god, I wasn't even trying to do that. That was sick as hell. I'm ready to put you away now. That fired me up. Let's go. Kick to the knee. Time for the knee of glory. Wrap it up. Let's go, ref. Count faster. Let's go. Securing the win. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, Robert, you put up a good fight. But at the end of the day, we retain that title. When can I go on my date with Gigi Dolan, by the way? The undisputed WWE Universal Champion Brandon Collins buried Robert Roode in his first title defense of the night. Of the way, wait, 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 first of the night? Can't wait to see what's next on a groundbreaking night of SmackDown. Hold on, hold on. I'm defending more than once. Truth. First of all, where did the suit come from? You look nice. You're dripping. We got to talk, though. Dark Horse, thanks for coming in. I was hoping you had a minute to discuss your performance review. You have a suit? I always have a suit with me every time I travel. What if the hotel has a pool? Did you forget yours? I might have an extra or else we can always take turns. What the hell are you talking about? I meant the suit you're wearing. Oh, this? Once I became GM, I started reading up on some business concept. One tip was dress for the job you want, not the job you have. So while you were in the ring, I was looking to see if there was an astronaut suit laying around. Huh? Struck out on that front. 
But I found this baby in MVP's locker and thought maybe I should put it on so I could look more authoritative. Luckily, MVP said it didn't fit him too well, so he didn't mind if I borrowed it. What do you think? I, I think you look nice, man. That I shouldn't have agreed to come on this trip with you. I also agree with that. That grouchy attitude is exactly why I wanted to have this performance review. I'm looking for team players. You know teamwork makes the dream work. This is a nightmare. That's spirit. Now make sure you keep that mentality when you get out there for your next title defense. So for your next match, I want you and Chad Gable to really explore the space, just like two astronauts, except there will be gravity. Uh, thanks for making that clear. No problem. As long as I'm GM, I don't want anyone out there thinking I've suspended gravity and they can't fall. You can. And in this match, those falls will count anywhere. Got it? Falls count anywhere title match against Chad Gable. All because our GM is a borrowed suit-wearing space cadet. Maybe someday. Why? Why am I having multiple title defenses in one night? Bad news, the circus troupe was heading the opposite way. With their accents, apparently Milwaukee and Kansas City sound very familiar. But I was able to get onto a bus of seniors heading home for a riverboat casino weekend. Hold tight, I'm on my way. Hurry up. Hey, you know what though? I am happy to be going against Chad Gable. This man deserves a championship opportunity. We're gonna have a great match, ain't that right, Chad? Beat Chad Gable anywhere in the arena. Say less, let's get crazy, but first off, Chad Gable gonna pick the leg real quick. Target my ankles? What you doing, dog? Already out of match, so let me chill. This better be the last match of the night, I'll tell you what. Oh, get off me, Chad. I see what you're trying to do here, though. I see what you're trying to do. Big and Nagi, though, sit your ass down. Oh, you getting right back up? All right, I got something for you then. I got something for you then. Oh my God. Uh oh, he's getting a little tired, y'all. He getting a little tired. Big dodge. Oh, oh, I missed to the corner. Oh, he faked me out. Okay. All right, Chad. This man grabbing a table. He trying to get crazy already. Yeah, set that table. Oh my God. Hey, he still hit me. No way. What we got now? Oh, drop this man on his dome piece. Watch him get right back up. Yo, bro, sell for me, dude. Come on, let me pick him up. There we go. Can we get crazy? How crazy can we get? Springboard? Okay. Sick. <laughs> sick. Oh, there we go. All right, baby. Yeah, yeah. Stay on the table. Let's get crazy. Oh, that was sick. What the hell? Bruh, the table didn't even break. We're going to lift him up. It's time to put him through. Through the table goes Chad Gable. One, two. Oh, but he still kicks out. Where are you going? What's popping, Chad? Yeah, you ain't see that coming, did you? We still ain't done, Chad. Let's go. We're going all the way over here. Chad, how about we go backstage? Does that sound like a plan to you? Because that sounds like a plan to me. Let's head back here, baby. Fight me. Fight me, Chad. Oh, big knee. Oh, that combo was dirty. Yeah, you think about that for a second, Chad. Don't mind me. Just going to take the easy way up. Appreciate you. Ref, you coming with me? Nope. He tried to come with me. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, this man going to take the ladder? You're crazy. Oh, I hope you know what's in store for you, Chad. I hope you know what's in store for you, Chad. You are going through this. Come on, come on, break. Let's go. Chad, I'm sorry it has to be this way. Actually, I'm not that sorry about it. Goodbye, Chad. Uh, bro, go over. Go, go over. Let's go. Let's go. What you want with this? Oh, that looked like it hurt. All right, we're on our way down. We finna pin this man. Is he getting up already? He's getting up already. Oh, catch that. Nia Glory. Ref. One. Two, let's go. That was sick. Might be cold outside, but the heat is on inside the arena. Brandon with his second successful WWE Universal title defense of the night. Never been so jealous of victims of a natural disaster. That looks like so much fun. Yeah, you are psycho. Truth, what happened to the suit? Great match out there, champ. Can you believe just a few hours ago, there were people saying I wasn't suited to be a GM? You weren't. Yes, people like me. And we were right. I agree. That's why I took the suit off. Turns out being a GM is pretty tedious. It's mostly just logistics, and those are my third least favorite kind of sticks. But while I was bored in my office, I was watching you out there, and I was thinking that you look pretty tired. Did he just say tedious? I wonder why. Probably because of the two title matches. There's no way to know for sure. Okay. Anyway. I figured you being dead tired might mean this is my best chance to beat a dead horse. And since I'm in charge and there's no audience, I'm taking you on in a 24-7 style match for the title. Starting right now. Well, not literally right now, but in a few minutes backstage, 
See you there. Wait, wait, wait. Are you saying for my title or the 24-7 championship? I need, I need this to be clear. Almost there. Unfortunately, the seniors had gambled away most of their gas money, but I met a woman who raised sled dogs. Be there in two shakes of a husky's tail. What the hell? Who says that? All right, Truth. I, all right. <laughs> I was just back here, and now we got to fight back here again. Defeat our Truth by pinfall. We can definitely do that. Truth, man, you, you're a scummy man. I just had two matches. Now we in the third match, and you want my title? You know what? Hold that. You know what? Actually, Truth, hold that. And just for good measure, Truth, hold that. Oh, he reversed that one. All right. Oh, he gave me the swiftest kick. Uh, I'm going to give you a one count. Not even, actually. Big moves. Let's go. Nia Glory. I don't know if that's enough to win the match, but your boy is tired. I am gassed. One, a two. Oh, no way he got the shoulder up. No way. Meet me up here. Meet me up here. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He giving me the Reese's Pieces. Oh, oh, oh. Get crazy. Get crazy. All right. Just send me off. Thanks. <laughs> Let's go. How'd that scout it? Hey, we had a shovel match earlier. Truth, hold that. <laughs> Truth, I'm about to hit you with the nastiest near glory of all time. End this match, bro. There's no way he's kicking out of that. Are you kidding me? What is this? What is this? Oh, what a cutter. That is it. Oh my God. Our truth is a different kind of animal. Oh, shot right to the head. Oh, 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 he got up. Oh, scouted, scouted. Rip D. One, two. Let's go, dude. He put up a fight. Finally, we can talk to Troy. Champ, I am so excited you're here. Would you take offense if I said that every time you're this excited, I worry something bad is going to happen? Oh, not this time. Miz has the most must-see, vertically integrated, synergistic, incredible stunt in the history of SmackDown planned, and you are the star attraction, huh? Um... Okay, fine. The suspense is killing me. Or maybe that's just your breath. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Kidding. I'm on my way. I'm telling you, you're going to love this. Love it. Love is in the air. Till Seth do us part? Is Gigi in a wedding dress? Say less. Where have you been? Sorry. Finally, we can talk about my plan to make you the brightest light on the road to WrestleMania. I don't suppose your tux can be explained away by dressing up the announcement of who I'm defending against at Mania. Think bigger. We are going to do a WWE classic. A wedding. Um, who exactly is getting married? Oh, it's as bad as you're thinking. <laughs> if by bad you mean brilliant, Guys, the WWE Universe loves the chemistry between the attractively toxic Gigi Dolan and the most must-see Universal Champion in WWE. Uh, I'm the only Universal Champion in WWE? The point is, the marriage of Gigi Dolan and the WWE Universal Champion will draw more eyeballs than a royal wedding. Take that, Regal! I love a publicity stunt as much as anyone, but I have questions. Same. A lot of questions. And I have all the answers, but right now, you guys have to get dressed. Get dressed for... We are announcing your big engagement with a Miz Match Challenge. Gigi and the Dark Horse versus the hottest couple in WWE history, Miz and Mrs. But we didn't get engaged. Yeah, I have concerns. Lay them aside and put on your formal wear, because we've got an engagement to announce. Jesus Christ, a mixed match challenge coming up. Oh, Maurice is dripped out right now. The most must-see couple in WWE history, ladies and gentlemen. Look at us. We are dripping tonight. And we looking good. Look at that title around your boy's waist. Looking fire. Are we really wrestling in suits right now? I can't believe we're about to wrestle in suits right now. This is what we doing tonight? Take out your frustration on The Miz and Maurice. And I also have to tag Gigi Dolan three times in this match. Oh my God. I mean, I don't even need to tag GG in right now. I got this handled, but I will tag her though. Just cause I got to tag him three times. All right, GG, let's go. Oh, what a boot. Yo, M Miz and Maurice about to get a royal ass whooping. I'll tell you that right now. All right, I'm tagging again. 
Attack three times. Maybe that's the second time. Oh, Miz came in with the aggression. I see you. Really? You're going to attack Maurice? All right, bet. Attempt to defeat the Miz and Maurice. Ain't no attempt. We will defeat the Miz and Maurice. Yo, I'm actually kind of having fun with Gigi's Musa. <laughs> She's kind of nasty with it. What's the sig? Oh, 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 oh. Oh, shout out AJ Lee one time. All right, she got out of that fast as hell, though. I did not appreciate that. Maurice is trying to get crazy in a dress, ladies and gentlemen. Maurice from the top rope. It did not work out. High risk, no reward. Tag, let's go. Oh, let's go, Cutter. That was so sick. We're going up top. Oh, Miz is already back up to his feet. It doesn't matter from the top one and elbow. I ain't done with him yet, though. I ain't done with him yet. We're going to hit him one time we go hit him a uh, two time and we go hit him for a third time one two oh miz still kicked out though all right gg dolan getting tagged back in oh she reversed the sig this is not good this is an accolade absolutely not absolutely not let's go oh, come on my finger getting tired no no, I switched. Oh, interesting glitch, though. I accidentally switched, and um, it just canceled it out. That's good to know. That is very good to know. We just won off of shenanigans. I, hey, a win is a win. I'll take it. I'll take it. Look at this power couple right here. Who's stopping us? Tonight's the night. Wedding bells will ring on SmackDown when Gigi marries Brandon Collins. Didn't they just get engaged? Brandon and Gigi barely know each other. This is scandalous. Can't wait to see this sham of a wedding. Congrats to the fake couple. Rollins looks pissed. Suck it up. Get out of my business. Tonight's our big night. Gigi, what are you doing? I'm not supposed <laughs> to see you before the ceremony. Bro, we just had a whole match. Well, shoot. I guess if watching me beat up Maurice in this beautiful dress didn't jinx our wedding, this definitely put a nail in the marital coffin. What is actually happening tonight? I don't know, but that squirrely producer Troy had me sign a bunch of paperwork, which makes me think this might be more than a TV stunt. Yo, I signed some stuff too. You don't think Miz is looking to turn this into some kind of weird made-for-TV arranged marriage, do you? I wouldn't put anything past him. Well, we've managed to make lemonade out of his lemons so far. I say we see where this goes. Besides, you ever see a WWE wedding without a twist? True. All right, hubby. N nope feels weird yeah yeah i kind of like it of course you do of course you do gross hey hey hey, hey we ain't gotta say gross it ain't that deep could have just been no not gross i don't like soap operas but brandon trying to look suave is the funniest thing i've seen in years shut the hell up roman how about you show up here we go the wedding has commenced well Gigi, i hope you're ready to get married Look at the beautiful couple. Ladies and gentlemen, we are gathered here today to celebrate the beauty of love and lifelong commitment. Clap it up, everyone. Doing love and commitment? They're just jealous. They are jealous. Before we recite the vows, does anyone here have reason to object to this wedding? Why are y'all booing? Speak now, or forever hold your peace. Let us have our moment. Uh, Troy, aren't you skipping a couple of things? Isn't there the, uh, ceremonial... The, the tying of our hands thing with the ribbons. We still need to do that. Uh-oh. Shenanigans. Wow. Wow. The man is dripped out. And so is Seth freaking Rollins. For an interruption, weren't you? Let's hear it. You want to see these two goofs go through a Mrs. Shotgun wedding? Or do you want to see the hottest, most influential, most fashionable, real couple? in WWE renew their vows. Why is everybody hating on our love? Let us have our moment. Let's go, preacher man. Get to the vows. <laughs> Becky is so He's funny. my groom. Uh, this wasn't part of the plan. Seth, you got a problem? She you 
are not gonna spoil my TV wedding. Oh! She hit Rollins? Oh, Becky finna give you the fist, Gigi. No, stop, stop, why she, stop. Why'd she grab her face like that? Security. Damn! Somebody. Gigi, no! That, that's my future wife and now we brawling! What the hell, man? Oh no. Oh, okay. <gasps> you got lucky. Please stop. Please listen to me. Go to commercial. Go to commercial. Look, look, can I have my moment? Can, can I have my moment? Remember the big WWE wedding segment that Seth and I got? Oh wait, we never had one. So you decided to steal ours, Becky? Explain to me again how you're the good guys and we're the toxic ones. Because everyone knows I should be the WWE Universal Champion so I can match accessories with my wife. So how about it, Brandon? I heard you need a dance partner. Put that belt on the line at WrestleMania. I'll tell you what, Seth. You get a shot at the undisputed WWE Universal title at Mania only if Becky puts her title on the line against Gigi. It's on. Seth needs something blingy to hold his outstanding pants up. What is this conversation? <laughs> this feels weird in my mouth to say, but thanks. I'm gonna mark today in my calendar. Gigi said thank you. Stop or I'll take it back. Putting the WWE Universal Championship on the line to get me a title shot at Mania is kind of a big deal. I appreciate it. We're partners in crime, right? And nearly married co-hosts. We really dodged a bullet there. Or actually, more like a missile. Come on, it wouldn't have been that bad. I guess. At least my phone wouldn't be getting blown up by Miz right now. I don't think he cares about the wedding going off the rails. He's more upset we went into business for ourselves with these mania matches. Then I guess we better win. I mean, there's no way Miz messes with his golden couple, right? I'm a champion, and you're about to be one. We'll pretty much dictate all the terms in the world to Miz or whoever we need to. Well, I'm just going to have to beat Becky Lynch in the middle of that ring. When WrestleMania is over, we'll be the most powerful duo in WWE. I like the sound of that. You simply cannot help going your own way, can you? How could you not consult with me about your WrestleMania match? If the ratings were not incredible for you and Gigi's wedding, there would be consequences. Just remember, I am the boss around here. Got it. That's all you can say for yourself? Uh, I'm focusing on my WrestleMania match. All right, goodbye, miss. <laughs> I was not expecting this. I'm about to be playing as Gigi Dolan in this match. Let's go. I'm about to win you a championship, Gigi. I hope you're ready. You're about to be holding that title high. You're about to become immortal when you beat Becky Lynch at WrestleMania. But not before she taps me out. Jesus Christ. That bar was moving fast as hell. Becky, yo, Becky, chill. It ain't the disarmor, but Jesus Christ, she's trying to take my arm off. Look at my health already compared to Becky. This is not good. Let's go give her a couple of strikes to the face big kick that's what i'm talking about gg dolan in control i'm telling you we about to be the biggest power couple in wwe where are you going uh-uh get back in here i'll let you get back in too becky let's go let's go becky yeah <laughs> let's hit her with the sig let's go oh my god she got out of that so fast becky is different damn uh, can i reverse this midair Oh, there was no reversal. The man dominating. There we go. Oh, let's go. Bring her in for the finisher. Let's go. Get back in. Get back in. Pin her. Pin her. Pin her. Use that resiliency, Becky. Get it off of her. She didn't even need it. Becky Lynch is a walking cheat code. Oh, no. You didn't let me dodge. No, I was too late. She going for the bridge again. Oh, but she did not go for the cover. Oh, time for the comeback. Let's go. Becky never saw it coming. She's getting a couple of clotheslines and a super kick. Come on, let's go. Into the submission. She ain't gonna tap, is she? Oh, she might. Oh, she might. Tap, Becky, tap. Tap, Becky, tap. She's putting up a fight. Ah, Becky, tap. Let's go. Come on, it's so close. Let's go. Becky Lynch taps out. GG Dolan is your brand new women's champion. The question is, will Brandon Collins be walking out of WrestleMania with the WWE Undisputed Universal Championship? We about to find out. GG, what's popping? The title looks great on you. You just beat Becky Lynch like I knew you would. That was amazing. It felt amazing. Did you see the look on her face when I held up the title? And now it's your turn. 
Go out there and embarrass Becky's beau. You got it, partner. I'll be watching. You got this. It's time to walk out of WrestleMania with that Universal Championship. Come on. All right. It's time for a WrestleMania banger. Don't run at me, Seth Rollins. Come on. Perform three combos on Seth Rollins. Yeah, Seth Rollins about to get the nastiest combo right now. Let me tell you something, brother. We got this WrestleMania attire on. New gear, you know what I'm saying? Oh, Rollins with the counter already? No, sir. You're not going to get any offense in this match. Okay, never mind. Swing and a miss. And I was late on that. Oh, my God. Oh, where are you going? Oh, he meeting me outside. He scouted that. But I got the counter. It didn't matter. Give all the combos to Seth Rollins. Okay, combo landed on Seth. What next? Hit your finishing move on Seth Rollins. Oh, we getting cut scenes. We're going to get shenanigans. I already know. I swear to God, if Roman Reigns shows up in this match, I'm going to be so pissed. He better not cost me my title. Oh, big knee from Rollins. We already back up to our feet. Oh, let's go. Big Sig. Stay in Spanish fly. I feel like we're about to go into a cut scene. Let's go. Finisher has been hit. Beat Seth Rollins by pinfall or submission. Say less. I had to give him a stomp for good measure. One, two. Oh, but Seth got the shoulder up. Okay. Oh, he kicked me in the head. Seth didn't want the three-piece. He didn't want the three-piece and the biscuit. It was a very yummy biscuit, though. Oh, Seth looking to get crazy at WrestleMania. He got many WrestleMania moments, but he was looking for another one. But we already back up. Ends the Gary to Rollins. We about to get crazy for this. You want to ruin my wedding? I'm about to show you what's up. Rollins back up to his feet. Collins looking to get crazy with a blockbuster. From the top rope. Frog splash on to Seth Rollins. Hook at a leg. One, two. And Seth Rollins has been defeated at WrestleMania. Oh, but it's time for a cutscene. Yeah, get out my ring. That's what you get for ruining my wedding. What's going down, though? I don't trust this. Yeah, Seth, how does defeat taste? How does that feel? This man is defeated. Oh, oh, Becky's here. Hey, you both lost. Isn't that crazy? We're the real power couple around here. Me and Gigi holding things down for WWE. <laughs> Yo, Seth is on his knees crying. Yeah. What up, Gigi? Ain't it nice? <laughs> That's trifling. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, cry about it. Cry about it. <laughs> How long have we been champ? We've been holding this thing for well over a year. Yeah, let's go. Hit that corner. Hit that turnbuckle. Let's celebrate this victory. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. What did I tell you? Most powerful duo in WWE. I have one question for the two of you. Just who in the hell do you think you are? You must not have heard him. We are the most powerful duo in WWE. Do you think calling yourselves that means you can go around making your own matches at WrestleMania? Yes. I yes. am the general manager of SmackDown, AKA the most powerful man in WWE. I don't know. Troy's got pull. You think you're cute? I am your boss. You will show me respect. You get every bit of respect that you deserve, Miz. Which is to say, not much. You ungrateful. I made you must see when the WWE Universe was calling you a fraud. I made both of you. I gave you a hit worldwide streaming platform. Let's be real. You ripped off Xavier's show and push Gigi and me into a TV wedding that neither of us wanted any part of. The only fraud standing here is you, Miz. Agreeing to work with you was the worst decision I've made in my entire career. And clearly, we don't need you. So no more ripoff show, no more publicity stunts, no more Miz. Us, this, this arrangement, it is finished. Finished? Finished? You don't finish this. I do. Pack your bags, Dolan. You're going to Raw. Oh? What? Wow. I'm the WWE Women's Champion. You were, but you're Regal's problem now. So hand over my WWE Women's Championship. What? He can't do, do that. Now. 
No shot. I could take you down so fast. Go ahead. Hit me. I'll fire you and strip you of your title, too. It's not worth it. That's fine. I'm not going to have to strip you of your title. Because soon enough, you're going to lose it. Your next defense is going to be so grueling, it is guaranteed to end your reign. You are the pettiest human being I've ever met. Speak you on it, Gigi. are just a bad memory. Congrats on the big WrestleMania victory, champ. No, nah, that's so wrong. They could have just switched titles. He didn't have to strip her. No, nah, that's wild, actually. Hey, 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 you know, at least we're still the champ. <laughs> Breaking news with Miz both trading Gigi Dolan to Raw and canceling Down Up, Down Up. Can the WWE Universal Champion Brandon Collins focus on holding on to his title? Accentuate the positive. Up, up, down, down, he's back, baby. Yeah, whatever, Woods. All right, let's talk to Gigi. Well, our ascension to power did not go entirely as planned. I promise you, Miz is going to be out of the picture, and I'm going to... Hey, look, I'm all for being one of the many reasons you have to punch Miz's dumb face one of these days. But I'm not some princess you have to avenge. You beat Becky Lynch. You won the WWE Women's Championship, and he took that away from you. It makes me... Enraged? Me too. But you know what? You open the door... But I beat Becky Lynch. I won that title. I'm going to carry that confidence over to Raw and win the Women's World Championship. Hell yeah, you are. You need me? You know where I'll be. On top of the mountain on Raw. You're damn right. See you around, Dark Horse. See you, Gigi. Damn, Gigi going to Raw. I like her confidence. She's a glass half full kind of person. I dig it. Good guys, wanna be bad guys. Everyone who wears my undisputed WWE Universal Championship is just another guy who doesn't measure up to the head of the table. Well, where the hell are you? 666 days as Universal Champion. Can we talk about it? Till Seth do us part has been completed. Oh, we're back to Troy, Jesus Christ. Troy, so good to see you, man. You too, champ. Your big victory over Seth at WrestleMania has Miz in the most cheerful mood. Believe me, the whole team is delighted with you. I'm sarcasm for sarcasm. I dig it. What do you and our must-see general manager have for me now? A live interview on The Bump that you're already running late for. And believe me, you don't want to miss this. Oh, I won't. I've never been more eager to tell the WWE Universe all about the Miz's stellar leadership. Great! There's a car waiting outside. It's not a limo or an SUV. It's actually a compact rental car that you'll be driving yourself. And you owe us $74.38. And it will actually be more than that if you don't fill up the gas before you return it. Wow. You guys really know how to treat your champions. Thanks, Troy. That's so trifling. <laughs> <laughs> Some say the story was finally completed on night two of WrestleMania when Cody Rhodes won the World Heavyweight Championship at last. But it felt like a beginning to me, Kayla. I agree, Byron. But our guest at this time is also in the midst of an incredible story. Please welcome the man who won the main event on night one, the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Welcome, champ. Huge night for you at WrestleMania. Thanks, Byron. First, congratulations to Cody. He's been in the hunt for a long time. From one champ to another, here's to you. As Cody begins his championship journey, yours is becoming a marathon. I remember right after you won the WWE Universal title, Roman Reigns joked that you wouldn't last a month. Now it is day 666, and ooh, uh, hope that's not bad luck for your upcoming match. Wait, do you know something I don't? What match? Uh, yes, it wasn't meant to come out that way, but we do have some significant news to share on that front. Way to blow our big reveal, Byron. Anyway, Miz gave us the exclusive on your next championship defense. Oh, snap. Well, I'm here. Might as well say it. Before I do, just remember we're only the messengers. This is straight from the Miz. You will defend the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against five other superstars 
in an elimination chamber match. No I think way. Mrs. Words were actually, I'll put the toughest opponents from his past inside a cage and see if he's lucky enough to survive. Ha, 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 ha. So, uh, thoughts? Who's I'm in the not match? Phased. Sure. This will be one of the greatest tests of my reign in the elimination chamber. And Miz can bring out all the heavy hitters he wants, but I'm not going to need luck. Luck isn't going to enter the picture. They used to call me the Dark Horse. But now the WWE Universe knows that I am a workhorse. I'm going to out-hustle every man in the chamber. And I'm going to walk out still the undisputed WWE Universal Champion. Because Miz sets him up. And I knock him down. What a promo. Anything else you want to cover? Uh, I think you made your point. Dude, who is going to be in the chamber? Watch it be like Seth, Kane, Kevin Owens. Oh, my God. Tonight, WWE Universal Champion Brandon Collins faces his greatest challenge yet as he defends his title in the Elimination Chamber against Drew McIntyre, Logan Paul, Kevin Owens, Seth Rollins, and Kane. Oh, my God. The ring general will have a close eye on this match and will defeat whoever walks away champion. Enjoy these final moments before you kiss your title goodbye. This is, ah, you hate to see it. Hello, William Regal. Look at the smile. You look entirely too happy to be a general manager. I finally got the champion I should have had for quite some time. Cody, good for him. Good for the business. He's an amazing talent carrying quite the legacy. I'm proud of him. I get your relief. The World Heavyweight title gets passed around so much over on Raw that it must have been hard to keep track. Hopefully Cody can hang on to it for a while. Hopefully you can hold on to the WWE Universal Championship through the Elimination Chamber tonight. Miz has assembled quite the rogues gallery. Yeah, consisting mostly of guys I already beat. Overconfidence can blind one to unseen threats. I'm coming up on two years as WWE Universal Champion Regal. I think I've earned a little confidence at this point. Hey, that's fair. Well, how you've changed. It would be interesting. Interesting what? What? If you get through the elimination chamber, perhaps Miz and I should start a conversation about the match everyone expected on your first night as champion. You versus Cody Rhodes. Oh? Bring it on. The match everyone expected me to lose? Bring it on. Wonder who the odds would favor this time. A fine question indeed. One that's been hanging over my head for a long time. I'm thinking maybe you're right. It's time we answered it. I'm so down for another match with Cody. Maybe. But we'll talk more later. If you can survive tonight, good luck. Watch, they finna have me come out in this chamber first. I already know. I'm starting out this elimination chamber with Logan Paul. This is crazy. All right, Logan, let's see what you got. You better be prepared, sir. We have not faced Logan Paul yet in this My Rise, so I'm actually a little excited that we get to start out one-on-one. -on -one. Elbow to the head. Yo, I'm dominating. Who's next? We need some competition in here. Oh, hold up. Big moves. Oh, Logan got the counter. Oh, oh, a couple of body shots right now and a shot to the face. Logan Paul's, oh, oh, he's still continuing. And Kane just entered this elimination chamber. Things just got crazy as I get dropped on my head. This is going to be a tough elimination chamber. Look, the influencers got to work together, Logan. Let's go. Temporary truce. I was trying to leave. Let me leave. We got the big red bitch to worry about. Who's entering this elimination chamber match next? Oh, snap. Seth freak. I can't see. Seth freaking Rollins has just entered this match, and I'm bleeding, ladies and gentlemen. That's how you know it's a chamber match. Now we getting crazy. And Kane looking for a big move, but he got none of that. Will it be Drew or will it be Kevin entering this elimination chamber match next? It's going to be Kevin Owens. Still no eliminations. And Drew McIntyre is going to be the last one to enter as well. Kane is getting the combos right now. And we're about to drop this man on his head. And Drew McIntyre has just entered the match. Can Brandon Collins retain his title in this chamber match? What's up, Rollins? We just had a crazy match at WrestleMania. I'm taking my attention back to you. Standing Spanish fly. Get him out. Get him out. He doesn't have resiliency either. Two. Oh my God, Seth still kicked out anyway. There's two pinfalls going on. Drew kicks out. 
Kane has been eliminated from the elimination chamber by Logan Paul. Wow, we are climbing right now. It's time to get crazy. Oh, Kevin, Kevin want to fight with me? Oh my God, Logan's climbing now. Logan's climbing now. This is insane. No, no, Kevin. <laughs> oh my God, Logan. Yo, we're all going crazy. Logan in the corner now. Let's get Drew in the corner. Let's go, let's go. Time to get crazy. A little disrespect to Kane real quick. Double choke slam from the Spartan. Let's go, come on. One, two, Drew kicked out? No way, bro. All right, pin Logan, pin Logan. One, two, three, no, what? What is going on in this chamber match? No, sir, he tried to go for the Claymore. Near glory. That's it for Drew. If he kicks out, I come on. Two. Let's go. Drew McIntyre has been eliminated. Seth Rollins looking to eliminate Logan Paul right here. Kevin, let him get that. All right, I'm going to pin Logan then. One. Two. Seth Rollins kicks out. One. Two. And we stole it. Logan Paul has been eliminated. I will gladly take that. It is now me, Seth Rollins, and Kevin Owens. Pop-up powerbomb. Will Kevin Owens be able to eliminate Seth? Wow. I'm actually surprised by that. It is just down to me and Kevin Owens. Kevin, hold this standing Spanish fly real quick. And you know what? You know what? We need to get crazy. This is the end of the match. Let's go. From the top of the pod, Brandon Collins, oh my God, to retain the title. One, two. Oh, Kevin kicked out. No way, bro. Oh, he got the counter. He got the counter. Oh no, stunner. Oh my God. Oh, no sell, no sell, no sir. Come on, Nia Glory for the win. One, two. Three, let's go. Oh my God, what a chamber match. Give me my title. Blood, sweat, and tears. The rain continues. I just survived the toughest opponents from my past in the elimination chamber. So now what? Do I take some time off? Maybe hit the golf course? Rest up and recover? Nah, I don't think so. See, there's one other superstar in WWE who's actually been champion longer than I have. And I've been hearing rumblings for a long time that he deserves what I have. That somehow he's more worthy than me. I'm talking about you, Gunther. Oh. I'm ready to quiet all the doubters once again. You think you deserve what I have? Then come and try to take it. Oh, snap. Hold up. One in the chamber has been complete. Bold move. Challenging the longest reigning intercontinental champion in WWE history. That's who fortune favors, Troy. The bold. I suppose we'll have to see about that. I'm hoping that means you have some good news for me. And Miz has agreed to my request for a match with Gunther. Oh, no, absolutely not. Miz giving you anything without strings? Could you even imagine? <laughs> no, yeah, but I didn't imagine having to deal with you at the airport either. Lucky day for everyone. Gunther could certainly be in the cards, but why rush into it when Miz has so many hand-picked opponents for you? Like oh, Bronson God. Reed, who you'll be taking on in a non-title match next. You ready to head to the arena? I can't wait. That should be a good match though. I like Bronson Reed. This might be the first time you've ever given me good news, Troy. I can't wait to get Bronson in the ring. My goals reach no higher than the happiness of SmackDown's WWE Universal Champion. Undisputed. You left out a word there, buddy. Wow, Bronson Reed is such a dope competitor. I'm actually really excited to face him one-on-one. -on -one. All right, this is a non-title match. I'm hoping there's no shenanigans. Oh my God, Bronson Reed. You didn't have to charge at me like that. We could chain wrestle for a second, man. Put on a show, bro. <laughs> and uh, oh, face first. I thought we were doing a Russian leg sweep. Oh, a couple of knees to the face. Big Bronson Reed can't do nothing against your boy. Irish whip to the corner now. Collins looking to build some momentum, but Big Bronson Reed was able to counter. Forearm to the back. To the ropes we go. Okay, here we are. <laughs> Shaking off the cobwebs a little bit. Where is this man going? Yo, I'm not ready for a tsunami yet, brother. 
Oh, I missed wildly. And so did Bronson. I got something for that ass. Oh, never mind. Never mind. Bronson Reed got right up to his feet. Oh, this man is pissed off right now. Bronson Reed delivering the strikes to the face. The Universal Champion may be in trouble now. Yo, yo, yo. You ain't got to throw it back on me like that. Chill, bro. Bronson, the power and the strength that to lift me up like that. Yeah, well, roll out. Roll out. Kyle is doing the wise thing. Getting some separation. Is Bronson Reed about to fly? Bronson Reed! Oh, my God! This man is not playing around. Yo, this match has been pretty solid so far. I can't even lie. Got me up on his shoulders. Oh, a wasteland. Hold up. Hold up. That was a sig, too. Count of five. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Damn! Oh, my dome piece. Looking to pin the Universal Champion. Oh, God. Okay, only gonna be a one count. Only gonna be a one count. You ain't gonna catch me slipping, Bronson. Oh, look at this. The combination of strikes and a forearm to follow up. I think Bronson's bleeding now. This has been a grueling match. Kyle is looking to fly. Big 450. No. Bronson moved. He moved. Oh, what a headbutt. Bronson Reed from the top rope. Tsunami. One. Two! Brandon Collins kicks out of the tsunami. Oh my god, dude. Bronson is not playing. Bronson up on his feet, near glory. Into the cover. Hook of the leg. One, two. Bronson kicks out. I didn't think he was gonna kick out of that. I'm not even gonna hold you. Brandon Collins climbing up to Bronson Reed. Oh my god. Spanish fly from the top. That's gotta be it. That has got to be it. Two. Oh my god what is it gonna take brandon collins getting desperate here from the top rope the universal champion got all of it frog splash for the win collins does it what a match dude oh snap the intercontinental champion is here what a match between bronson reed and brandon collins oh my god dude but gunther the Intercontinental Champion is face to face with the Universal Champion. Tell me we're about to have a unification match. Come on, two titles, two belts, Brandon on the way? Brandon fears Gunther. You see his face when the Intercontinental Champion got in the ring? Funniest thing I've ever seen. I'm tired of this man. Where the hell is he, Troy? Our general manager? He doesn't report to me. Zero interest in small talk, Troy. I want Gunther now. Do you? I mean, he was standing right in front of you, and you didn't do anything about it. Troy, you talking all that mess? We can settle this in the ring, partner. What are you trying to say? I'm not trying to say anything, champ, but it's all over social media. I was just reading a post from Roman Reigns that made you look like a joke. What do you mean? All the more reason not to keep stalling. Except there is. Our Intercontinental Champion is very important to the future of SmackDown, and Miz is off making sure that his top superstar is happy. Oh, wow. <sighs> what now, Troy? What flaming hoop do I have to jump through for Miz to give me what both of us already want? You will be facing the Ring General's top lieutenant, Ludwig Kaiser. Easy. If I didn't know any better, I'd say Miz is doing the thing where he tries to wear me down before my next big match. Miz would never. <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm out, Troy. I'll beat Kaiser. Then Miz had better give me Gunther so we can settle this once and for all. Look, Ludwig about to be beat in less than five minutes. Let us be clear. The WWE Universe knows Gunther is the one true champion. The undisputed Universal Champion merely labors in his shadow. You misunderstand the pecking order around here, Kaiser. Looking forward to showing you that in the ring. Ludwig was talking all that mess. Let's see if he can put his money where his mouth is. Oh, get off me, Ludwig. Beat Ludwig by pin or submission. You already know we gonna do that. He gonna get beat in less than five minutes. And I'm about to have my fun. That's one. Oh, that's two right here. And that's three. But right, let's see if we can put him away with that. Before one? Oh, okay. All right. All right. Oh, I missed a super. Missed a super. Really? A figure four? This man going for a figure four already? Absolutely not. We just gonna break out of this submission real quick some light flip it back on him how'd that feel ludwig how'd that feel give me them legs 
Oh, okay. It's a Geary from Ludwig Kaiser. He gonna run at me. Oh, he actually caught that? No shot. No shot. Speaking of... What? He just flew. Forget Ludwig. This is Clark Kent right here. Jesus Christ. Oh, Ludwig. Ludwig. Looking for the finish. No, sir. Uh-uh. Not gonna happen. Turn around. Standing Spanish fly from the Spari. Let's go. Hook it a leg. One, two. Oh, he's still kicked out. All right. I definitely underestimated him. It's definitely been more than five minutes, I think. That's all right, though. We're going to the top. Guarantee he ain't kicking out of this. He ain't kicking out of this. Frog splash to Ludwig. This is what put Bronson away last week. One, two, and three. Come on. Come on, oh, snap. Imperium jumping your boy. Should have seen this one coming from a mile away. Gunther came dripped out in the in a trench coat. It's like that. All right, I need a squad of my own. Yo, where is the Miz? I need to speak to this man. All hail Gunther. The era of the Dark Horse champion has ended and the must-see age of Imperium has begun on SmackDown. Every time you count me out, you end up eating the numbers as soon as they're out of your mouth, Miz. My era is far from over. Ah, oh, you look like you've been in a car accident, champ. <laughs> Uh, Miz wanted me to extend his deepest sympathies. Oh, I'm sure. That's not exactly how he phrased it on social media. I can't believe the flowers haven't arrived already. I'll have to put in a call. Yeah, okay. Stop the cap. I just got the hell beaten out of me, Troy, in another one of Miz's traps. You sure you want to be doing this right now? No. No, I am not. Gunther and his lackeys jumped me. I want to show them why I'm the undisputed WWE Universal Champion up close and personal. Then you'll be happy to know that Miz has given you exactly what you want. You'll get your wish when you face Imperium next week in a gauntlet match. You gotta be kidding me, bro. You know what? All right, watch. It's gonna be Giovanni first, Ludwig, and then Gunther. And then I'm guessing it. Gunther gonna whoop my ass. Cutscene type shit. Here we go. We got Giovanni Vinci first in this gauntlet. Say less. They, they want to go from weakest to strongest. I get it. I get it. We about to make quick work of Giovanni Vinci. See, that's the thing with gauntlet matches. We really got to take our time and make sure we don't catch damage in the first couple of matches, especially if Gunther is our last person. Giovanni Vinci got no idea what he just walked into. Imperium want to jump me? Say less. Your boy going to get his revenge. Giovanni back up to his feet, roll through, double knees, and he's bleeding. This is who you bring me first? Oh, now this man playing possum. This man smelling his own blood. Oh, I missed. Oh, Giovanni. Okay, that's cute. The champion doing the wise thing and rolling out of the ring. Giovanni Vinci got caught slacking. Hold up. Brandon Collins able to drop him with a suplex. Oh, now we battling. Now we brawling. Here, here, you ain't getting back in the ring yet. Oh, he got the counter. Now we're really going back and forth. Giovanni Vinci drops Collins on the outside. What a move. And now Giovanni... Wants to pin the universal champion. Oh, but he's going to talk first. Count of six, brother. You might want to get back in the ring. Count of seven. This man doing redecorating. Really? You feeling that confident? What? How did he still catch me with that? Oh, Giovanni plants your boy. That was his finisher, too. What? Oh, not even a one count. Get, get your weight up. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even mean to kick out that early. Nia Glory, get this guy out of here for the first elimination in this gauntlet. Oh, Giovanni kicks out. All righty then. All righty then. Oh, from the top, Brandon Collins looking for a 450, and he got it on his back, too. That's definitely going to get him eliminated. There's no shot. Let's go. Who's next? I already know the answer to that. Actually, bring Ludwig out. Yeah. Come on out here. Can I leave the ring? Ah, oh, he's lucky. He's lucky. I can't move. I would have attacked him out by ringside. Let's go, Giovanni. You remember that ass whooping I gave you last week? We cannot let Ludwig get any offense. We got to stay on the aggressive. I'm trying not to use my resiliency either. I want to try and save it for when I absolutely need it. Oh, let's go. This man about to get dropped right on his head. Absolutely beautiful. And another one. I know you remember this, Ludwig, because you got caught with three of them last week. But you know what? This time we're going to finish with a knee to the face. Pin this man. Can we get the job done? 
Oh, only a one count. All right, all right. From the top rope, we looking to fly, baby. Oh my God, all the way to the center of the ring. Frog Splash did not land. Ludwig looking to take advantage here, targeting the arms of Brandon Collins, targeting the limbs, and a stomp right to the arm. Ludwig looking to fly, and he got it. To pin the Universal Champion, only going to be a one count. Got to do more than that. Oh, a couple of chops, and he's doing more than that. But he got caught slipping. He got caught slipping, and he got a knee to the face. Brandon looking for a springboard blockbuster to eliminate Ludwig Kaiser. Two, and that was enough to do it. I didn't even have to use the SIG. Gunther, bring that ass. Let's go. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I thought this was just Imperium. We got Ilya? What the hell? Hold the phone. Okay, a random turn of events. I was not expecting this. I thought this was just Imperium. Yo, Ilya though and Imperium would be so sick. That would be so fire. All right, now, now we really gotta be on our A game. Ilya is nothing to play with. His finisher is deadly as well. We really got to stay in control of this. I got something for you. Drop kick to the outside. Little springboard forearm to the face. Let's go. We're going to send him back inside of the ring. Collins looking for a big move. Oh, Ilya ran right into it. Oh, my God. Ilya got planted. Absolutely beautiful. Hit the sig. Hit the sig. Oh, my God. He moved. No way. He moved just in the nick of time. Ilya, come on. This is just disrespectful. I didn't need those slaps. I'm in trouble. Oh, wow. Oh, reverse the sig. Let's go. Let's go. Put him down. Standing Spanish fly. Oh, we about to capitalize big time. We about to... What? He raged to block it? That's actually insane. That is actually insane. Oh, drop down. Oh, my God. He hit me with the finish. No way. No way. I might have to use resiliency. Oh, still a one count. Let's go. I'm OP. I feel like Super Cena right now. Oh, Nia Glory had that scouted. He knew better. One, two. Oh, my God. Stop, man. Stop. All right, we sending him out. Shout out to Ludwig for doing some redecorating for us because I got something that'll put Ilya down for the one, two, three. This is, this is ridiculous. Will this work? Please tell me this is going to work. Oh, let's go. Big move. Oh, what? Are you serious? Sell for me. This man played possum. All right, bet. Bet, since you don't want to sell for your boy. Okay, he's hitting me with the Reese's Pieces. Oh, I got the reversal. Weave. Let's go. Turn around. Let's go. Corkscrew cutter. One last move for Ilya. Let's go. Frog splash. That's got to do it. That has got to do it. Two and three. Bring Gunther. Oh, my God. No. No. Wait, is Gunther not in? It didn't even end with Gunther. You hate to see it. This man is playing games with your boy. After barely surviving a gauntlet match with Imperium, Gunther laid out the undisputed WWE Universal Champion Brandon Collins in a display of ruthless aggression. The ring general wishes to thank his finest opponent, Ilya Dragunov, for punishing Brandon. Wow, okay, so y'all got mutual respect now. I just got a message from WWE.com. They ran a poll, and the majority of the WWE Universe thinks that it's Gunther's time to rise. I don't care what the WWE Universe thinks. I mean, I do, but not when it comes to that. Maybe the WWE Universe didn't see me take out two-thirds of Imperium in their hired gun. Or maybe it's that the Age of Imperium has such a nice ring to it. Epic. What do they even call your run, huh? All this time as WWE Universal Champion, has anyone ever actually said it's your era? What's up with everybody talking sh Troy, Roman, Miz, who wants the smoke? They don't have to say it. They know. That's what I'm talking about. Clap back. Well, good news. After that gauntlet match, Miz decided that this rivalry has had the proper buildup. So you'll be defending the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against Gunther at Night of Champions in a no disqualification match, just like you wanted. I'm very cool with that. Stacking the deck against me. Must be Friday. Contrary to dirt sheet rumors, Gunther will not 
be defending the Intercontinental Championship. Only the WWE Undisputed Universal Championship will be on the line at Night of Champions. You lose your confidence, Miz? Sure does sound like you're scared. I'm going to walk away with all the gold. Miz is scared of that. Come on. Why, why are you holding out? The Intercontinental Champion versus the Universal Champion. This man going for a chop already, and it did not work. Couple of chops to Gunther. Yeah, I got chops of my own, man. Oh, Gunther pushing your boy off. Okay. See, that's going to be difficult. I didn't know there was a weight disadvantage against me. Oh, this man already going for a weapon. Wow, Ring General. Wow, okay. I see how it's going to be. Dropkick to the knee did not do anything to Gunther. This man didn't even get on the mat yet. Oh, tried to go for a sling blade, but Gunther had that scouted. Boy, don't try and sit that ass on me. What the hell you thinking? Get out of my ring, Gunther. Get out of my ring, Gunther. Yeah, go chill with your boys or something. Go chill with your boys. Let's go. Forearm to the face. He got his goons with him. What up, y'all? No, no, no. Y'all catching some. Oh, my God. <laughs> that looked like it hurt me more than it hurt them. Well, we also can't take our attention off of Gunther for too long. Oh, this man fought back with his own chop. It don't have to be this way. Face first into the turnbuckle. Oh, all right. A little snake eyes. Now I'm bleeding. One. That's all you're going to get from me. How is his title not on the line? That's messed up. He's still not down, man. There we go. Get off your feet. Oh, Gunther. On the outside. Collins looking to fly. And he wipes out the Intercontinental Champion. Gunther getting back up to his feet. Spear. Spear. He got caught with a nasty spear. Looking for the finish here to put the Intercontinental Champion away. Frog Splash for the win to retain the Universal Championship. Gunther gets the shoulder up. Oh, Brandon Collins is looking to dominate there, but Gunther putting Brandon down right in the center of the ring. What is this man finna grab? Gunther, what? This man grabbing a whole ladder? What is he cooking? And now I can't move because Giovanni Vinci is distracting me. Let me fight back. Oh, okay. He faked me out. Oh, no. He dropped that ass. Gunther looking for an opportunity. Didn't really work out there. Springboard. No. Tried to get him with the blockbuster. Didn't work, though. Gunther was right on top of it. Now, a couple of knees. Gunther is dominating right now. Fully in control of this match. And I can't do a damn thing about it. The Spartan fighting back, though. Kick to the midsection. Big slap. Oh, he's already up. Nia Glory to retain the title. One, two. Oh, Gunther kicks out. All right. This man went to go grab that ladder. I want it now. We bringing that inside. The Spartan can get crazy too. To the corner now. Right where I want him. Oh, he missed. Gunther, no. He got a good reversal too. Oh, let's go. Roll up. Roll up. Surprise. <laughs> One, two. Let's go. The roll-up gets the job done, baby. He never saw it coming. The Spartan retains the title. I definitely did not lose at any point in the night. <laughs> Before we introduce our next guest, let's set the stage. Cody Rhodes is still the World Heavyweight Champion on Raw, providing some stability after a tumultuous period that saw several champions come and go. I don't understand why we do these recaps. Our audience watches the product. Nonetheless, I'll play ball. On SmackDown, after continuing to dominate, the Dark Horse has become the Work Horse, now holding the undisputed WWE Universal Championship for three plus years. Damn. Didn't Miz and Roman Reigns think the champion stint would only last three days? And now he's approaching Roman's record setting run. <laughs> Unbelievable. Why don't we ask Miz about that misguided prediction right now? Please welcome our guests, the SmackDown and Raw General Managers, The Miz and William Regal. First of all, I take offense to the accusation that I ever doubted my champion. I know how to pick a horse, and in this case, Come on. I was behind the dark horse since day one. Stop the no, cap. That's rubbish. You never wanted him to be champion, and you've done everything in your power to try to put an end to his reign. Don't insult the audience, Mike. They watch the product. Thank That's you, what I've been saying. You want to do this, Regal? At least I have a cohesive show. No one can keep track of what's going on on Raw. It's like a freaking middle school play. Guys, come on. 
How do you even know what's happening on your show? You're too busy of filming episodes of your terrible reality show that no one watches. Oh. You just think you're better than me because you've made a living on the myth that you're some kind of technical wrestling genius. Well, I'm here to tell you, no one who matters cares. I agree with some of what you said. I am better than you. That's why they made me the general manager of the A Show. Wow. Okay, maybe we take a break, yeah? No, we're not finished here. <laughs> you think Raw is the A Show? Yes, I do. But we can officially answer that question in the ring at Survivor Series. Oh. War Games! Oh, snap! Fine. SmackDown will see you and beat you at War Games. <laughs> Whoa. We'll see who's pathetic, mate. Okay, let's get to that break. Wow, okay. What are the War Games teams gonna be? Take a look, though. 1,078 days. Put some respect on your boy's name. I never lost. The going, going Gunther story has been completed. As heard first on the bump, it will be Raw versus SmackDown at Survivor Series in War Games. William Regal has wasted no time in announcing his team of champions. Captain and WWE World Heavyweight Champion Cody Rhodes, US Champion AJ Styles, and his club partners, Raw Tag Team Champs Carl Anderson and Luke Gallows. That's quite the squad if I do say so myself. Balls in your court, Miz. Who's gonna be on our team, though? I am absolutely done with that overrated, blubbering British buffoon Regal. He thinks Raw is better than SmackDown? Well, at War Games, the blue brand will reign supreme, especially with you as our team captain leading the way. Hold on. Did you just name me SmackDown's team captain? Yeah, why wouldn't I? Yeah, for You're a champion. You've had the title on lockdown for years now. Yeah, despite everything you've done to try to take it from me. I mean, I assumed you were going to pick anyone but me. Where is this coming from? You sound like Regal. I've been Team Dark Horse since the beginning. Man, I am shocked you think I feel that way. <laughs> Whatever, Miz. Who else do you have to round out our side? I got your old rival Seth Rollins on board. Okay. But I figured I'd let you choose your other two teams. Let's go. See? Told you I'm on your side. Right. So Seth and two other partners of my choice. I'll see what I can come up with. Great. Make sure you choose carefully, though. Since Raw has all champions and an established faction making up three quarters of their team. But no pressure. You got this. Okay, we get to choose our War Games team members. I like that. But we will be doing that in the next episode. Buddy old pal, we meet again. What do you want, Seth? Okay, we'll skip the pleasantries. What I want is for you to pick good teammates because I'm not going to go out there at Survivor Series with you and a couple of stiffs and be embarrassed by Team Raw. You do a fine job embarrassing yourself every time you get dressed, but don't worry. I got this. Funny. Don't mess this up. Come on, Seth Rollins. I need you to believe in your boy. Believe in the Spartan, all right? Well, who we got? I see mommy. We got Kevin Owens. And that's it. Um, hey, Rhea, how you doing? Hey, Rhea. You, uh, interested in joining Team SmackDown for war games? Can Rhea compete with the men? You wish. I actually want to talk to you on behalf of Dominic. Okay, all right. What's Dom so afraid of saying to my face? Not afraid. He just doesn't think you deserve his time after he helped you beat Kane with the taser and you never really thanked him after. Okay, all right, all right. That's fair, that's fair. You can thank Dom. That's not quite how I remember it. <laughs> Whatever. I'm not here to argue about the past. I have a proposal. Dominic would be willing to put any ill will aside and join your team for war games if you did something for him in return. What do you want, Dom? What's mommy's boy have in mind? Take out Dom's old man once and for all in an ambulance match. In an ambulance match? Raise a legend. That's a bit brutal, even by your standards. If you want Dom's services, that's the offer. Take it or leave it. Hey, you know what? I wouldn't mind playing an ambulance match right now. I'll do it. Fine. I don't feel great about this, but I need to have any and all options on the table when it comes to selecting my team. I'll do it. You've made the right decision. We'll be watching. Hell yeah. Let's get Dom on our team. Look, Ray, I got nothing against you. No disrespect. This is just business. It ain't personal. 
No pinfalls, no submissions, no disqualifications, no count outs. The only way to win is by putting Rey Mysterio's small ass in the ambulance. Look, Ray, I want to have a clean match. I don't want to use any weapons if I don't have to. I respect you too much. Oh, big elbow from the Hall of Famer, Rey Mysterio. Ray looking to fly. Oh, that was beautiful. Oh, rolled out of harm's way. You'll love to see it. We're going to tag him. We're going to bam. Do a nice suplex. We ain't done yet. Look at the power. We're going to send Rey Mysterio to the outside. Rey Mysterio's up on his feet and he gets wiped out. Let's open this bad boy up. Let's go. Yeah. Send Rey into the ambulance. Close the door. Close the door. Oh, my God. Rey is fighting back. Oh, my God. Oh, no. Oh, Rey Mysterio able to survive. Oh, look at the strength. Oh, you looking to send me in? Okay. All right, Rey. Hold on. Hold on. He's a dog. He's a dog. I had to use resiliency. He's crazy. All right, we climbing. We climbing. Get up here, Ray. You scared? You scared? Come on. Oh, Ray Mysterio is climbing, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go, Ray. Bam. All right, let's pick up Ray Mysterio real quick. Don't reverse this, Ray. Get dropped. Let's go. Oh, he's already getting back up. What the hell? You just going to no sell me like that? That's crazy, actually. Oh, my God. I don't have resiliency this time. Ray actually might get this. Ray actually might get this. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No, sir. No, sir. And that right there. We're going to grab him. Turn him around. Lift him up. Cutter. He's done. There's no shot. Send him into the ambulance. Let's go. Close the door. Oh, I forgot there's another one. I forgot there's another one. Oh, no. He's going to get out of this. He's going to get out of this. No. He's a beast. I said I wasn't going to use a weapon, but you started pissing me off. Hey, Ray, hold that. I wasn't expecting him to actually hold that. Hey, Ray, hold that. <laughs> All right, back inside of the ring. Up on his feet now. The Spartan looking for a big move. Come on, up to the top rope. Another big move from the Spartan. Big frog splash. I'm just going to use the finisher. I'm just going to use the finisher. Near glory. That's got to be it, bro. If he doesn't go in after that, I don't know what it's going to take. Like, legitimately. Close the door. All right, easy, easy. We got that one. Please, let's just get the second one. Come on, we're that close. Let's go. Close the ambulance. Rey Mysterio is finally defeated. Jesus. That might have been one of the most difficult matches I've had in my rise yet. Oh, my Lord. Everybody knows that you can't have a War Games match or Survivor Series without God's gift to SmackDown. L.A. Knight. Yeah. I didn't know that. Is this true, LA Knight? Um, yeah. And if you are too much of a dummy to know this already, then give me five minutes in the ring to show you exactly what I mean. I can spare five minutes for the megastar. I think I can spare five minutes, but you might be the one who ends up looking like a dummy. Yeah. All right, LA Knight, you got five minutes. Five minutes of me time. Let's go. Try to beat LA Knight in under five minutes. Oh, God, that's going to be difficult. All right, we, we got to bury LA Knight, guys. I'm sorry. LA Knight, look, just bear with me, man. I want you on my team. This is no disrespect. This is just, this is actually, this is what you wanted. The Spartan has LA Knight right where he wants him from the top rope. Spanish fly. Let's see if we can win off of that. One. Oh, only going to be a one. All right. All right. To the outside. Oh, 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 I missed. That was kind of sick, though. That was kind of sick. It looked like I rolled off his back. I don't know if I can beat this man in under five minutes. He's just too good. But I'm better, baby. We ain't done with the Spanish flies yet. Let's go to beat LA Knight in under nope. five minutes. Really? Only a one count? And you going to roll me up? I'm not even going to give you a one count. How about that? Catch me outside. How about that? We got a minute and 40 seconds left. And it's time for an air glory. Caught him slipping. He don't even have resiliency right now. That's got to be it. Two. Oh, my God. He's still got the shoulder up. What is it going to take to put the Mega Star down for good? I want to try and make him tap at least. I want to try and beat him in under 40 seconds, basically. Just tap. Just tap. Oh, my God. It wasn't even close. It's getting spicy, guys. It's getting spicy. Let's go. Big reversal. 13 seconds. 10, 9, 8. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Oh, he kicked out. No. Oh, I thought I could steal it. Damn, damn. So do we get LA Knight? Hold on. Let me check my let me check my allies. <gasps> we did unlock LA Knight. Let's go. All right. LA Knight is definitely going on the team for sure. I don't know. I think I think talking to Kevin Owens might be the move. I'm going to get right to the point. You need me for war games. Okay. At least he wants to be on the team. Okay. 
I'll cut to the chase too. I'm 3-0 against you. So what makes you think you're worthy of being part of Team SmackDown? All right, Brandon, you ain't gotta be an ass. I've been in two War Games matches, which is two more than your zero. And Seth has never been in one either. You need my experience. In fact, you guys should be begging me to join your team. I don't know about all that. And even if I did want you on our team, I don't think there's any way I could trust you. You don't need to trust me. I'll be your hired gun. You tell me who to take out and I'll get the job done. I like the way it's sounding. Kevin Owens makes a good argument. I'll think about it. No, we're not gonna- No, I meant that literally. Tell me who to take out and I'll go do it. I shouldn't have to, but if it proves you need me for war games, then I will. Okay, fine. Yeah. All right. Okay, fine. But I want you to do this in an actual match, not attacking someone from behind like you usually do. Whatever, just name an opponent. Drew Gulak, Damian Priest, or Omos? <laughs> Put Omos down. Okay, hired gun. Go see if you can take down Omos. If that's what you want, I'll do it. Hired gun, let's see what you got. All right, let's see what Kevin Owens can do against Omos. Oh my God, I'm playing as Kevin Owens. <laughs> Try to beat Omos. <laughs> I can do that. Give him a couple of punches, a couple of jabs. Omos with the return though. Oh no, sir. Come on, beat his ass. Let's go. Oh, we got the SIG pop up power bomb. A rope break, are you serious? Where? Watch him run at me, watch him run at me. Oh, what? I jumped over him. Oh my God, look at the strength. This man just choke slammed me with my forehead. He just forehead slammed me. I don't know. <laughs> Almost to the midsection. Omos don't know what hit him. Let's go. He reversed the stutter. He reversed my stutter. He's got to finish her. I got to be real careful. Oh, oh, oh. We reversed it. We reversed it. Omos is in trouble. Let's go. Stutter. Oh, that's a rope break. You got to be kidding me. He's got to finish her. It's got my name on it. I think I saw him trying to go for it. Oh, my God. He got it. Choke slam to KO. Not like this. No, I had to use it. Better be safe than sorry. Am I right, ladies and gentlemen? Get off me. Let's go. Stunner. That's it. That's it. Count to 10. What? All right, bet. Bet, bet, bet. Back to the top rope. Frog splash. He got all of it. Come on. We need him on the team. We did it. Kevin Owens proved his point, and it looks like he's going to be on the War Games team. Hired gun has been complete. All right, KO, let's go ahead and put you in. Look at this team right here. This is a solid team. You here to spy on me, Troy? No, I'm here on behalf of Miz to make sure you're staying on task to recruit two teammates for SmackDown Survivor Series War Games team. So have you done that yet? Actually, excellent. Yeah. Ready to lock them in? Once you make this decision, Miz will let corporate know it's official, so you can't change your mind. Besides, we really need to start promoting the participants. And Miz has big plans he wants to kick off for the Build to Survivor series. So we got LA Knight, the Spartan, Seth freaking Rollins, and Kevin Owens. Team SmackDown is ready. I like the group I've assembled. Team SmackDown is ready for war games and whatever else Miz has planned. Good. I'll let the boss know. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> what the hell? We whooping ass backstage? What did Carl Anderson do? Oh, Luke Gallows here. All right, so the OC is going to be in the War Games match. I dig it. Oh, cutscene with Cody. Cody with the World Heavyweight Championship celebrating his victory, but what is going on? Uh-oh. These two know each other very well. Yeah. You about to be surrounded, Cody. Kevin Owens is here. We about to jump this man shield style. And here comes the sparring. You are surrounded, my friend. Uh-uh. Nuh-uh. Think wisely. Oh, here comes the phenomenal one. Luke Gallows here as well. Oh, snap. A little face-to-face. -face. We jumped your boy backstage. Bloody show, gentlemen. Save it for war games. Oh, Cody throwing the first strike. Oh, I hit Regal. I'm Regal, I'm sorry. Regal, no. Everybody leave. Everybody leave right now. Everybody leave right now. Everybody leave. <laughs> retreat, retreat. Regal, uh, just send, a, send the fine in the mail. I'll pay it. I swear to God. Kevin Owens still wants to fight. <laughs> it just got heated, ladies and gentlemen. 
We did what Miz asked, and honestly, it didn't turn out that great. I never wanted to assault William Regal. What do you mean? It was must-see TV, especially the part when you nailed Regal. Good stuff, pal. Whatever. So what does our genius GM have planned next? And where is he even? I haven't seen him anywhere since I got to the building. Well, with, um, tensions escalating and who knows how Rob would retaliate, Miz thought it was better if he stayed home this week. What? You coward. So, he ran away again. Got it. Look, what's more important is Regal is sending AJ Styles here for a War Games preview match. And Miz has so much confidence in his team captain that he wants you to decide who should fight styles i want to fight aj styles okay and you want my decision now yes and miz also said if you make the wrong call and we lose then it's completely on you so choose wisely whatever i'll face aj styles myself good i'll let the boss know all right, ladies and gentlemen, it is champion versus champion. If I lose, it is all on me. And it says attempt to defeat AJ Styles. So if I lose, I will lose, lose. Y'all know how much I like that. And lift him up, put him right back down on the mat. Up to the top rope, AJ Styles catches a Meteora. Oh, to the outside, Brandon Collins not done though. The Spartan is fired up right now. We got to put AJ Styles in his place. Oh, never mind. He's fighting back. Oh, what is this? AJ Styles targeting the arm. These two need to get back inside of the ring. That's exactly what both of them are going to do. Brandon's up. Oh, AJ, AJ, no. He caught me. Damn. It got me slipping. I ran into it. Oh, turn him around. Let's go. Spanish fly. And AJ going to roll out yet again. AJ, I got a forearm for you if you want it. I got a forearm for you. You ain't the only one who got a phenomenal forearm. Brandon's on the apron. He wants Styles on his feet. AJ has no idea where he's at. Buckshot Lariat into the cover. Hook of the leg. Let's put this man away. He didn't even need resiliency. There he goes. Mia Glory. I got to get that resiliency off of him. I got to get it off of him. Ah, uh, yep, yep, yep. Okay, okay, AJ. He's able to reverse it. AJ Styles has a finisher. He's looking to put this match away. I was too late both times. AJ Styles with the Styles Clash. No, this can't be it. Come on. Too easy. Too easy. AJ looking for an opportunity in the corner. Big reversal from the Spartan. We got him where he want him. Let's go. Come on. Nia Glory to pin AJ Styles. We got the job done. Let's go. Champion versus champion, and the superior champion walks out on top. Hello, GG. How you doing? You know there's no such thing as a brand war, right? We all get our checks from the same place. That's true. What? Next thing you're going to tell me is we weren't actually going to get married. Seriously, though. I know, I know. You're not wrong. Working with Miz again is the worst, especially since it all started because Regal hurt his feelings on a talk show. Doesn't take much. <laughs> right? But now it's gotten personal with Cody nailing me with that cheap shot and then everything with Regal. So you can criticize how we got here all you want. But when we step inside those cages, I'm going to make sure my team does whatever it takes to survive. Understood. Well, even though technically we're on opposite sides, Mind if I bum a ride to the building? Oh yeah, come on, sure. Sure, anything for my fiance. That's more like it. <laughs> Seth says, okay, War Games is upon us and I know we have a so-called team captain, but everyone knows I'm the architect. So follow my lead and all will be fine. Cool, so does that mean we all wear over the top ridiculous outfits? I'm worried we won't have time to coordinate, says LA Knight. Kevin says, we should definitely come out to Seth's music since he's our fearless leader. Seth says, how do I remove myself from this group chat? Or better yet, the match itself. This is going well. Glad we were forced to team with you, Seth. 
Let the war games begin. Let's go. As the Dark Horse strike Cody Rhodes in the center of the ring. Oh, we're going to have a cutscene in this match? I like that. I can't do any pinfalls or submissions yet. I just got to beat down AJ Styles. We just had a good match on SmackDown, and it's time to have another banger here at Survivor Series War Games. Catch that boot. I got to face the OC, AJ Styles, and Cody Rhodes. That's a fire team. Can we talk about it? That's basically Bullet Club right there. <laughs> Seth freaking Rollins is up next. That is what you love to see. Oh, turn him around. Rip Courtney. Shout out to Seth on that. Seth freaking Rollins is about to enter this match. Is Seth going to go for a weapon already? That's what you love to see. Oh, my God. AJ Styles is getting messed up by the Spartan. This man grabbing a sledgehammer. I like that. And now a stop sign. All right. You know what? We're going to bring the stop sign to the other ring. Seth, you, you can handle this. Seth, Seth, help me out. Seth, help me out. All right, sick. I landed right on the stop sign. Seth, you kicked me. We're just gonna put this stop sign right here. Oh, sorry, Seth. Didn't mean to do that. We're about to get Luke Gallows in this match. AJ Styles getting back up to his feet. Springboard, didn't really work out for him. Turn him around, rip core knee. Luke Gallows has now entered the match and I'm about to fight big LG. Let's go. Are we going over there? Oh, no, we're not. No, we are not. Luke Gallows with a big boot. Oh, but we got the reversal again. I'm on that circle. Oh, what a boo. Luke, Jesus Christ. Come on. I'm ready to send this your way. Come on. Bam. <laughs> Bro, throwing weapons is the best thing that 2K has added this year. I swear to God, man. Oh, LA Knight has joined this War Games match. Yeah. Oh, this man is grabbing a table. See, LA Knight, this is why I wanted you on the team. You know what's up. Just going to lean that right there. Let's go. Springboard. Oh, another one. Let's go. That was fire. AJ Styles has me up on his shoulders. AJ. Oh, my God. Rollins looking for a curb stop. Curb stop. Let's go. Carl Anderson about to get in the match now. LA Knight looking to climb a little bit. Yo, LA Knight from the top. Let's go. Yo, we tussling right now. Oh, that was so fire. Seth, that was sick. Curb stomp. Let's go. The teamwork of Seth freaking Rollins and Brandon freaking Collins. Let's go. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We just broke the table like that. That was fire. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Luke Gallows just shut me down, though. Kevin Owens is now in the War Games match. That means we only got one person left, and that's the world heavyweight champion, Cody Rhodes. My question is, do we have to win the match? Because that's going to be hard to do. I can only do so much by myself. We up to the top. From the top. Luke Gallows on his feet. Cody Rhodes on his way. And Brandon Collins, oh my God, crashed and burned. Cody Rhodes is in. The bell has rung. Let the war games begin. I'm taking my attention to Cody freaking Rhodes. All right, it says we need to get him in the center of the ring. There we go. Cody Rhodes and I going back and forth. He's giving me the strikes. Oh, Cody getting crazy. <gasps> Crossroads. Crossroads. You gotta be kidding me! I just got buried! <laughs> no way, man. I was putting in work. Cody pinned me? No way. I'm sad. I'm heartbroken. Boo! Really? Y'all going too sweet? Y'all going too sweet? All right, I see how it is. You've planted some seeds, Cody. I want my rematch, Cody. Survivor Games has been completed. And now here's Cody Rhodes. What are you doing here? Slow down there, Tiger. Don't get hot. This isn't an invasion. Then what are you doing at my show? Do they not have gyms at Raw? I'm here with news because I wanted to tell you man to man and not have you read it on social media. To think I could have continued to live in blissful ignorance. Sorry to be the bearer of bad news, but after I beat you at Survivor Series, Miz and Regal are giving the WWE Universe what it wants, you and me title versus title at the Royal Rumble. Yes, That's please. That's actually good news. Thanks. Honestly, you could have slid into my DMs to let me know. Miz asked me to come to SmackDown. He made an additional proposition. <laughs> let me guess. The WWE Universal Champion and the World Heavyweight Champion in a tag team match for the first time ever. And it's gonna be awesome <laughs> he 
He tell you already? Guy learned at the feet of Teddy Long. So what do you say? We obviously both like gold. You ready to team up? I'm in. I'm, I'm down for that, honestly. You know what? Hell with it. I'm in. I knew you wouldn't resist the opportunity. Go team. Dark Horse versus Destiny. Champ and champ teaming up. This is beautiful. All right, Cody and I will be teaming up on this SmackDown. I actually really dig that. Now we need a temporary tag name. The the American Spartans, the, the Georgia boys. That's all I got. Damage the Viking Raiders as Cody Rhodes. All right, tag made to Cody Rhodes. Let's do it. Eric about to get this royal beat down, you feel me? Big superplex. Cody Rhodes got to follow up with a splash. Look, Brandon Collins is off of a big loss from War Games due to Cody Rhodes and his team... How did you get that tag? Yo, excuse me? All right, bet. That's fine. That's fine. Ivar in the match. Oh, this man throwing oh, hips. Yo, put the hips away, man. All right, you don't have to throw me. The Viking Raiders looking to make a big statement. Absolutely not. I'm going to let you think about that decision with the DDT. How about another DDT? Win the match by pinfall with Cody. Yo, excuse me. This is my career, not Cody's career. Tag made to Eric. Eric about to get hit with a SIG. Oh, yeah, I forgot his SIG is a pedigree. Let's go. How are you tired, Cody? Crawl to the right corner. A little faster now. Hot tag to the Spartan. We back in. Brandon Collins feeling good. Drop kick to Eric. We got to stay on the aggression, Big D. Let's get him stunned. He's up. He's up. Near glory. Get him out of here. Tag made to Cody Rhodes. We're going to lift up Eric. He's still stunned. Turn him around. Crossroads for the win. A one, a two, and a three. Just like that. Come on. We would make a fantastic tag team. The Georgia boys reigning supreme. <laughs> I don't know what name to give them. <laughs> champs versus champs. After their awesome win last week, Cody Rhodes and Brandon will square off against SmackDown's tag champs, Ridge Holland and Butch. We aren't going to roll over and hand you our titles. We are going to give you a fight. Hey, partner. You ready to win some tag team gold? Partner? I'm your partner now? Wait, what are you been out of shape about now? We've won our match, and now we've got a title opportunity. Which sure is great. I guess I just didn't realize that our team was the dark horse and the show horse. What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means you spent our whole match out there hogging the spotlight instead of working as a team. I did what was necessary to win. That's a problem for you? No, no problem. I just see you, Cody. I see you. What you need to see is that our next opponents are the SmackDown Tag Team Champions and they are not going down without a fight. Don't worry. I'm focused. My eyes are most definitely on the prize. Good. Then maybe the next time we see each other in an airport, we'll be carrying heavier bags. Yo, Brandon, get out of your own head right now. We could be holding two championships. Who belts Brandon could be in the building. Don't ruin this. Tonight is a big night. We are facing the Brawling Brutes for the SmackDown Tag Team Championships. This is gonna be good. Trade three tags with Cody Rhodes. Oh, we could easily do that. Everybody's already in the ring. It's champ versus champ right now. Cody Rhodes getting his ass whooped. I need to help my boy out. Oh, I was too late on the counter. This man got me in another submission. Let my arm go, dude. You understand me? I am the... Yo, what is happening on the outside right now? <laughs> they are still scrapping out there. Oh, yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Send him out there. Tag made to Cody. Yes, sir. Oh, I tagged him on the back like that? I didn't even know you could tag people like that. Now we got to piece this man up. The world heavyweight champion going to work. We trying to hold two titles each right now. Brandon Collins and Cody Rose are going to need to work as a team here. We saw a little bit of bad blood starting to brew. Brandon Collins doesn't know if he can really trust him. Another tag made. And Pete Dunn. Oh, what a strike right to the jaw. And Pete said, I need a breather. I need a second. Ridge Holland is in the match now. Psych. <laughs> what the hell? I see why you quit. <laughs> Sorry, that was mean. I got my finisher, but I'm going to save that for a second. Let, let's, let's have Cody have some fun. That's what I'm saying. Tag made. What we got here? A little uppercut. Cody Rose going to follow through with a neck breaker. Teamwork does indeed make the dream work. We about to make this look easy. Pedigree to Ridge Holland, but we ain't done yet. Turn around. Let's go. Crossroads. Tag made to the Spartan. Brandon Collins looking to win the tag team championships for his team. 
Pete Dunn, get out of here. Ridge Holland getting pinned for the one, two, and three. Ladies and gentlemen, we got new tag team champions. Two belts, Brandon, in the building. Let's go, dude. I was not expecting this. The American Spartans are your new tag team champions. Let's go. Give me my other title, too. Yeah. Let's freaking go, dude. That's sick. Oh, little stare down. Hey, hey, we're a team. Let's get along. Let's be on the same page. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. The two greatest champions in WWE are on a collision course for the Royal Rumble, but now they're SmackDown tag champs together. Can Cody Rhodes and Brandon coexist? Mark for Life says, no, I've seen this one before. <laughs> let me let me have my moment, you Mark. Champ, how you feeling? Feeling good. Much to my surprise, I'm feeling great. I thought Miz was out of his mind teaming us up, but it's worked out pretty damn good. Cheers to that. Another lucky break. Another lucky break. Even when you dole out compliments, you manage to make them patronizing. The word lucky triggers you? I've just been hearing it for a long time. Because you got lucky beating me for the WWE Universal title. All right, gloves off, here we go. What would you call it? I had you beat when Roman came in. It's been more than two years, Cody. You, Reigns, Miz, all of you keep talking fluke like I haven't been beating everybody who comes at me. You haven't beaten me. Not until the rumble, partner. We'll see. For now, we have one more title defense before then. See if you can keep your ego in check long enough that we can win the damn match. Here we go. Who are we facing? Yet again, the SmackDown Tag Team Championships are on the line. It's me and Cody Rhodes, the American Spartans versus Alpha Academy. And this man, Chad Gable, is going ham right now. He is looking for an opportunity. My Lord. Damage either member of Alpha Academy. Jesus, I'm trying. Oh, this man tagging in Otis already. Little frequent tags. I like it. Damn. <laughs> Otis just got laid out by the Spartan. Yo, I'm pissed. That's why. Psych. Let's go. Turn him around. Rip Courtney right to the jaw. Look, Cody, if we win this match, I'll get a Spartan tattoo on my neck. That way we're matching. <laughs> we both got wings. It'll work. Just trying to wear him down as much as he can. Face first into the mat. Tag in Cody Rose. I can do that. Tag made to Cody Rose. Cody. What's your problem? Excuse me? Cody, what's the deal? What's the deal? Talk to me, man. Talk to me. I thought I was going to be the troublemaker. Why did Cody just leave like that, man? You don't want two gold? You don't, you don't want two championships on my knees? Cody, we, we, talk to me, man. Talk to me. We, we can talk about this. All right, there we go. Finally. Otis gets sent right into the steel steps. I'm getting back inside the ring. I need to. Oh, okay, all right. I tried to level the playing field a little bit. Oh, what the hell? I couldn't even reverse that. Oh, Otis about to launch me across the ring. My lord. Yo, Otis, take it easy on me, man. My tag partner left. Tag made to Chad Gable. He's back in the mix. Roll through, double knees right to the face. See, this is why you goofed. This is why you goofed. Springboard. All right. That move is now broken. <laughs> it don't even matter. Oh, forearm did not land. Chad Gable had that scouted. Drops me in the corner of the ring, and now he's just being disrespectful. Don't even slap my head, you bastard. All right, now he's going to pin me off of that. I'm not going to give you a one count because he slapped my head. Maybe if you didn't disrespect me, I would have gave it to you. Nia Glory. Let's get Otis out of here. Up on your feet. Let's go. Why are you turning around that way? That's cool. We're going to hit it this way then. <laughs> Nia Glory, let's pin Chad Gable to retain our SmackDown Tag Team Championships. It's fitting that I only have one of these. Still your SmackDown Tag Team Champion, Brandon Collins. Um, Cody, we need to have a conversation. I've been a part of a lot of teams, but never with someone as jealous and narcissistic as Brandon. The only thing that gets me through it is the fact that I'm going to beat him for the WWE Universal title at the Royal Rumble. Should have seen this coming. You have a thing for walking away when a situation gets tough. Oh my God. Shots fired. Pew, pew, pew. Jesus. Troy, I don't want to talk to you. Where's the Miz? Where the hell is Miz? What he said. Uh, uh, Miz is at a very important media promotional event. This man talking out his ass. He hightailed it as soon as Cody jumped off that apron. 
didn't he? Have you checked your social media? People love the drama between you and Cody. Besides, you guys can fix things up before your next match. There's not going to be a next match because I have had enough of that sanctimonious entitled SOB. Our run as a team, it is over. So you can have your tag team championship back because I am done. Well, hold on. Who belts Brandon in the building? Let's talk about this. Miz is not going to be happy about this. I don't care. When I beat Cody Rhodes for the heavyweight title at the Royal Rumble, I'll be able to go to any brand I want, any time I want. Miz's control over my career will be finished once and for all. Huh. Your boss is really not going to be happy about that. For years, the WWE Universe has been waiting for Brandon versus Cody Rhodes, the rematch. Gold defined them, brought them together, tore them apart. Tonight at the Royal Rumble, one of these men walks out with the WWE Universal and World Heavyweight Championship and becomes a legend. Roman Reigns says, legend? More like just another wannabe attempting to follow in my footsteps. If you're looking for a real legend, I'll be on the set of my latest soon-to-be hit movie. It's gonna flop, Roman. Suck that. <laughs> Wait, pause. <laughs> Here we go. Champion versus champion, rival versus rival. Former tag team champions are going at it. There's a lot of story here in this Royal Rumble match. Brandon Collins is absolutely taking it to Cody Rhodes right now. Let's go, drop down, leapfrog. Oh, no, no leapfrog, apparently. No yeet. <laughs> Cody Rhodes taking control of Brandon Collins' mistake there, not wasting any time getting to the action. But Cody Rhodes gets to prove now if the win that Brandon got a couple years ago at SummerSlam was a fluke. Absolutely not. I'm going to tell you that right now. Nah. -uh. These two going back and forth now. Uh-oh. We already traded blows. Uh-oh. This is a heated rivalry, baby. Let's go. Oh, what the hell? What? We didn't do another one? How did he get the advantage on that? Oh, gets it that time. Oh, swing and a miss. Brandon Collins has something of his own. Let's go. Collins cutter, baby. One. Oh, only going to be a one count. Cody Rhodes is not going to go down without a fight. I'll tell you that. The American Nightmare. Hold up. Crossroads. Crossroads for the Universal Championship. One, two. Oh, and Brandon Collins kicks out. We're not going out like that, Cody. Absolutely not. Cody wants Brandon Collins up on his feet, and he wipes him out. What a match at the Royal Rumble, my lord. Oh, but Brandon gets, gets a kick. Sends the American Nightmare back inside of the ring. Cody Rose doing whatever he can just to stay alive in this match, but he gets dropped on his dome. What does Brandon Collins have in the tank? Knee of glory out of nowhere. Will that be enough to win another championship? Cody Rhodes with the kick out. What is it gonna take? Both titles are on the line. Someone is walking out as a double champion. Will it be the American Nightmare or will it be the Spartan? And again, Brandon Collins is staying on top of Cody. Cody can't seem to get much offense. Brandon Collins looking for a big move. Oh my God. Cody is down and out. Brandon Collins is on the top. Cody turns around, frog splash all the way out to the outside. Really trying to put the exclamation mark on this match. Cody is stunned, he is out of it. Hook of the leg to win the World Heavyweight Championship. Cody Rhodes is defeated by the Spartan. Let's go, give me both of them. Give me both of them. Come on. You're undisputed champion, ladies and gentlemen. Hey, ain't this just beautiful? Are you surprised? No flukes around these parts. I'm holding two world titles. Too many titles, I can't even hold them. Let's go. And the story is complete. Cody, you don't even get your title back. He's done it. Brandon defeated Cody Rhodes to become the undisputed WWE Universal World Heavyweight Champion. Wow, that's a long name. <laughs> Fun fact. Brandon Collins will tie Roman Reigns' record-setting WWE Universal Championship reign at this year's WrestleMania. Oh, that's absolutely beautiful, ain't it? What up, William Regal? What's poppin'? Good to see you, champ. Oh. Congratulations on your big win against Cody at the Rumble. Huh. Feels good to finally quiet the critics. Indeed. And good to have you back here on Raw 2. Although last time you visited, it ended with me sporting a black eye. My bad about that. Uh, it was a heated moment and you got caught in the crossfire. Sorry about that. We good? I've been in this business for 40 years. If I cut ties with everyone who's punched me in the face, I'd have no friends. 
I'm glad we can move past that and focus on what's next. Don't you mean, who's next? Since you're holding all the gold, you'll be facing the winner of last night's Royal Rumble match. Who? Montez Ford. Oh! I've been wanting to mix it up with him for years. WrestleMania is going to be huge when I tear the house down with Ford and tie Roman's record. Well, we're going to give the WWE Universe a preview of WrestleMania when you and Montez have a little chat in the ring tonight. Let's do this. Montez Ford winning the Rumble? Shout out to 2K for showing my boy Montez Ford some love. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my distinct pleasure to introduce to you the undisputed WWE Universal World mm -hmm. Heavyweight Champion. Talk to me. That's quite a mouthful, champ. Well, hello there, Raw! It's pretty damn cool to be back where I started, but on a whole different level. Speaking of reaching a whole new level, I'm not the only guy who had a good night at the Royal Rumble. See, there's a man who's got a WrestleMania main event to cash in. A superstar who's ready to make the leap. Honestly, he reminds me a bit of myself from a few years back. I wonder why. <laughs> so let me introduce you to this year's winner of the Royal Rumble match. Montez Ford! Let's go. Bring the swag, my brother. Let's go. Let's put on a banger at WrestleMania, Montez. Huh? Here we go. Roman Reigns. Undisputed, huh? Look at you. Peacocking around like you mean something. That title you took from Cody at the Rumble, they made it up because nobody could beat me. You're not even a champ! I am so tired of hearing people compare you to me. Are you so deluded that you really think I would let a pretender like you tie my record with the Universal title? You shouldn't even be there. Montez Ford, you're a young man with a bright future. I'm sorry to say this, but you're not the guy I can count on to beat this clown at Mania. So there's been a change of plans. See? What I did is I took a big briefcase full of my Hollywood money, flew in my private jet out to the woods of Minnesota, and I hired myself a hunter who knows a little something about ending streets oh. at Mania. Hope it was fun while it lasted. Chill. Oh. My. God. You're joking. I was not expecting that. No way! Brock Lesnar? Oh, Montez, I'm so sorry. Oh my God, Montez is dead. Montez is dead. Oh my, yo. Solo, Spike! The Bloodline! Even Jay? I thought it was just you, Oos! What the hell is going on? Oh, super kick! What the hell is happening? Damn, damn. Yo, yo. Oh my God, Suplex City. This was very unexpected. Ain't no way. Jay, I thought it was just you, Oos. I cannot believe this just happened. I, I am actually shocked. <laughs> Royal Rumble match winner Montez Ford sustained a broken arm at the hands of Brock Lesnar, costing Ford his WrestleMania title opportunity. The WWE Universal and World Heavyweight Champion Brandon Collins has demanded a match for all the gold with Lesnar instead. This is why I'm the head of the table. You all thought the bloodline was dead, but we came back stronger than ever with a 
beast. I'm going to sit back and watch Brock Lesnar and Brandon Collins' dream of beating my record. Bro, I don't even know what to say. Isn't this great? Roman's brilliant plan put Regal in the hospital. So there's no debate now. Who's the best GM in WWE? It's me. Oh, brother. You are the picture of class, Miz. I have exactly zero patience for you or any of this. I want the bloodline and I want them now. I am generally not in the give the dark horse what he wants business. But in this case, I cannot wait to see Brock and the bloodline break you and your big dreams of beating Roman's record at Mania. Hmm. You're going to be disappointed. Very disappointed. You don't even sound sure yourself, but whatever. You want to get the hell kicked out of you on the way to Mania? Who am I to stop the fun? Sammy Zayn, a man who knows all about the bloodline. Hey, I hear you're going after the bloodline after what they did to you and Regal. I am. They're going to get what's coming to them. Nobody knows the bloodline better than I do. I know your story, Sammy. You don't. You only know what you saw on TV. Let me help you take them down. Okay, I like this offer, Sammy. Sammy, I appreciate that. I do. But this is something I have to do on my own. Look, I tried to take out the bloodline alone and it didn't work. You need backup. I owe my career to Regal. I wouldn't be where I am today if it wasn't for him having faith in me when nobody else did. And then the bloodline tore him apart while I did nothing. I hear you, but I'm telling you, you're making a mistake trying to do this alone. We haven't even talked about the fact that they have Brock Lesnar now. Yeah, I was not expecting that. I don't have time for any of this. I'm done talking. I'm taking down the bloodline now. I mean, we could still have Sammy's help, you know what I'm saying? Well, I tried. Good luck, champ. You're going to need it. We should have taken Sammy Zayn's help. Solo. What's poppin', dog? You better start looking over your shoulder, Solo. That's what I'm talking about. Get your ass up. It's time for a backstage brawl. Yeah, get slapped around. Take the fight to Solo Sokoa. Big elbow to the skull. The bloodline finna get stomped out. Oh my God. Oh my God. On the cement, dropping this man on his neck. Get up, Solo. I ain't done with you yet. I ain't done with you yet. Fight Sokoa over to the red car. Say less. We on the way. Oh, he's chasing me. He's chasing me. Oh, Solo wants the smoke. Come here. Bam. Oh, here comes Jay Uso and Jimmy. Here we go. The bloodline doing what they got to do. We should have taken Sammy's help. Spike. No. Jay, Jay, you don't have to do this. Jay, you don't have to do this, man. Oh, my God. They dented the car, man. You have to pay for that. Are they about to shield style power bomb me? Oh my God, that's exactly what they're about to do. Oh my God. Yo, this ain't cool, man. Okay, all right, y'all definitely gonna regret that. Then did the windshield. I'm hurting. The numbers game was just too much for the Spartan. Breaking. After sustaining injuries due to the Bloodline's brutal parking lot attack, Brandon Collins has been released from a local medical facility. Roman says, I love what my family did to the Dark Horse. How'd you like that trip to the glue factory? The glue factory? That's the best you could come up with, Roman? The glue factory. This guy. What up, Sammy? That didn't turn out so well. No, it didn't. <sighs> yeah, maybe you were right. Just a little bit. There is no taking the bloodline out one at a time. There's only taking them all out in a single blow with even numbers. The Usos have a match tonight. I should strike afterwards when they least expect it. Or should I say, we? You in? Yep, but knowing how they operate, we're gonna need one more guy. You got someone in mind? Ooh, one more? I do. Who? Seth freaking Rollins, LA Knight, or Kevin Owens? Come on now. We about to burn it down. Let's do this. Seems like the Usos have gotten a victory here tonight on Raw. Oh, but here we go. Beat the ass. Beat the bloodline down. That's what I'm talking about. Appreciate Sami Zayn for the help. Yeah, we are jumping them right now. Shout out to this universe mode cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we really beating them down. Let's go. I didn't know it was like that. 
take the fight to the Usos. We definitely about to do that, Sammy. Let's go. Irish whip Jimmy Uso into the lower right corner. All right, come here, Jim. Beat him down. Beat him down. It's only a matter of time before Solo comes out. I was just about to say it. Oh, headbutt. Yo, we'll burn it down. We'll burn it down. Seth. Oh, there we go. Burn it down. Let's go. They should have hit his music. That would have been so sick. Let's go. Shout out to Seth, man. Let's go. Taking out the bloodline one at a time. What a team right here. Sami Zayn, Brandon Collins, and Seth freaking Rollins. Let's go. Brandon must think he's pretty smart. Sami Zayn and the other ally the Dark Horse could find are going to regret it for the rest of their lives. And all that's going to be left at Mania are bones for the beast to pick. Don't let me down, Usos and Solo. You must be feeling pretty good about yourself after outsmarting the bloodline. Well, you get to keep riding that high because I have some good news for you. What you got for me, Troy? That would be a first. Miz has made a match. You and your two self-destructive brothers in arms are going to take on the bloodline in a no disqualification six-man tornado tag match. Okay, I like that. Oh, you managed to get that out without looking at the note on your hand. Good job, Troy. We accept. All right, it is time to take on the bloodline. Defeat the bloodline. Oh my God, there is so much happening right now. Chaos in this six-man tornado tag match. The bloodline is in trouble right now. We putting a work on them. Jay is stunned right now too. I'm taking advantage of that. Signature on the outside. Jay Uso just got wiped out. He's catching the work. Hey Solo, eat that. <laughs> hey Solo, eat that. Oh, all right. That one didn't do anything. All right. Solo, get up. Solo up on his feet. Nope. Nia Glory has been reversed. Oh, no. No. Spike from Solo. Not like this. Sammy, help. Let's go. Sammy Zayn with the save. Get off me, Solo. Absolutely not. Thank you, Seth. Let's go. What a stomp. Let's go. Pin him. Pin him. Pin him. All of the bloodline is down. Jay fighting to get back up to his feet, and he breaks the count. We're just going back and forth with the bloodline right now. This is crazy. Oh, let's go. Blue Thunder from Sami Zayn. I'll pin him. Since you didn't want to do the pin combo, let's go. One, two, let's go. Off the blue thunder bomb from Sami Zayn. We sold the victory from him, but we needed to get the victory. We got to put the bloodline down. Bloodline running scared. Roman Reigns is not going to be happy about that. Ugh. Where did Brock Lesnar come from? I was trying to take a sip of water. Yo! Somebody get the beast out of here. Brock, Brock, we don't have to do this. We don't have to do this, man. Yeah. All right. F5 on the chair. Don't pick up my championships. They are not yours. They are not yours, good sir. All right. Okay. Thanks, Brock. Are you even the one getting the championship match? I thought this was Roman's opportunity. My family let me down again, but I don't need them. I can't wait to kick back in my trailer on the set of my new movie and watch the beast Brock Lesnar devour whatever's left of that horse meat. I warned you, Brandon. Now the receipt is on its way. Hey, I'll put down Brock. I'll put down Roman. I'll put down Jay, Solo, Jimmy. I don't care which one of them it is. Miz, what the hell do you want? The walking wounded have arrived. I'm honestly surprised you made it, after what Brock did to you and your friends last week. Three plus years, Miz. I think you would have learned about doubting me by now. For real, man. Tonight, those doubts finally come true. I tried to warn you years ago that this would end in tears, that you would come this close in getting out of Roman's shadow and failed at the finish line is going to eat you up for the rest of your life. You know the definition of insanity, right? Repeating the same action again and again, expecting different results. So what? So that's you underestimating me and having it blow up in your face every time. Not this time. Not against Brock Lesnar. Yeah, okay, miss. I'm going to paint you a picture. I keep my titles tonight tying Roman's universal record. Then tomorrow, I watch night two of Mania with my feet up in a skybox as the clock strikes midnight and I beat Roman's record. Why am I? Okay, wait, just a little nitpick here. Just a little nitpick. 
why am I defending my championship on night one of WrestleMania? I should be the main event of night two. What the hell? No. Okay, thanks, Miz. Yes, Miz. Yes. And then on SmackDown, you are going to have the honor of introducing me as the longest reigning universal champion in WWE history. I guarantee you that will not happen. Yeah, we'll see, Miz. It is time to go to WrestleMania. My surgeons are cross with me. Surgeons, what happened? Doctors. In Britain, we call doctors surgeons another time. The point is, I've ignored their advice and I'm coming to WrestleMania. I want to see you face Brock in person. I can't say I support this decision, but I appreciate the vote of confidence. I have faith in you, champ. All right, both of my championships are on the line here at WrestleMania. We are taking the fight right to Brock Lesnar. We are not wasting any time here because the Beast Incarnate will not take it easy on us. We fighting back already. Rev, you might want to get out of the corner before you get hurt, buddy. Oh my God, Brock Lesnar is not letting me fight at all. Jesus Christ. Brock, chill. I got to hit you with two combos. Let me do it. There we go. We got the reversal. Sweep the legs of Brock. Let a brother have this. There we go. That's one combo. But I'm about to meet you with this combo again. Yo, Brock, let me land the combinations. Into the ropes. Oh, my God. Suplex City. That's number one. There we go. Let's roll out for a second. All right. All right. Brock is just having his fun right now. We're at a count of five. We need to get back inside of the ring. Brock Lesnar getting sent into the barricade. I'm getting in the ring. Let's break the count. Brock's back in. He got baited. Double knees. All right, let's go. Combos. Combos. We finally got that objective completed. Attack Brock on the floor, like on the mat or on the floor. Okay, yeah, this is definitely what it means. They want me fighting Brock out here. Say less. We can do that. Brock Lesnar on his feet. Spear. And he's stunned. Taunt Brock. Easy. Come on. <laughs> Brock Lesnar is on the table. We got him up. You stay right there, beast. Let's go. From the top, Brandon Collins through the table. Let's go. Get up. Get up, Brock. Get up. I ain't done with you yet. Springboard neck breaker. Oh, you know what? You know what? We need to put the exclamation point on this match. Let's go. Oh, all right. Sick. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try that again. <laughs> oh, my God. Let's go. Blockbuster from the top. Let's go. Frog splash on the Brock. Hook of the leg to retain our championships. Two. Brock Lesnar kicks out. All right, Brock. Let's go. Near glory right on the money. We got all of it. Two. Oh, Brock Lesnar kicks out. No way, bro. I thought that could have been it. Get up. He was trying to hit me with that F5. We're not letting it happen. Nia Glory. That is it. One, two. Brock Lesnar has been defeated. That's what I'm talking about. Retaining both championships at WrestleMania. We will break Roman Reigns' streak, baby. Let's go. Hold those titles high. I don't know. I don't feel like it's over yet. How did I know? You know what, Roman? I don't want to hear it. You've been doing this for three years now. Instead of, what is it you're doing? Celebrity guest host on some game show? Shilling your new NFT? Or maybe, <laughs> just maybe, you're filming another cameo in a failing sequel. Oh. Don't know what to say without a script? I'll help you out. Only table you're the head of anymore is the one that Rock brushes his crumbs onto. I'm here. I'm doing the work. And the only thing- I'm sure you got a lot to say, but it doesn't matter. When you want something done right, you gotta do it yourself. He's here, isn't he? He's here. Uh-oh. Oh, Spear! Uh-oh. It seems like we have our night too, ladies and gentlemen. Roman Reigns with the fake out. I guess he's done filming his movie. Ah, uh, that's what he wants. He don't even want the world title. Hope you're not too busy tomorrow night, champ. Okay. Because the landlord 
is back. And rent is due. Rent is due. Roman Reigns wants Brandon Collins at night two of WrestleMania. Don't throw up the one. Don't throw up the one. Put the one down. Put, put your finger down. Kayla, night one of WrestleMania was an incredible experience, but all of the focus now is on what happened after the undisputed champion defeated Brock Lesnar. That's right, Byron. Roman Reigns made a shocking return by laying out the champion right after his successful main event defense. The dark horse slayed the beast, but immediately fell to the head of the table. Roman Reigns then issued a challenge for tonight. And the undisputed champ accepted. For the first time in WrestleMania history, one superstar will be main eventing both nights. In addition That's to Charlotte Flair's huge women's world championship defense against Gigi Dolan, the WWE Universal title will be on the line. The undisputed champ will defend against Roman Reigns, who stated that his only interest is taking back his Universal title. At midnight tonight, whichever man wins will walk out the longest reigning WWE Universal Champion in history. Get ready for history to be made on night two of WrestleMania. You already know who's walking out with that. Stop playing with your boy. What's up, Regal? Glad to see you. You made it. I told you. I wouldn't miss this for the world. How are you feeling? You ready? You know, I've been getting the hell beat out of me for days. My ribs ache so bad it hurts to breathe. And uh, knowing Miz, I'm sure I'll have something up his sleeve. Typical Sunday night, then. Pretty much. I give you the full Churchill, but I don't think you need inspirational speeches anymore. No? You're a champion, twice over. You've more than fulfilled your potential. So I'll save the pretty words for the next kid coming up. Thanks, Regal. For everything. It's time to lock in. Let's go. GG, what's poppin'? Congratulations, champ. Thanks. I said I was gonna go to Raw and win their title, and that's what I did. And now it's your turn to deliver. You want out of Roman Shadow? This is the moment. I feel like hell, but I'll make it. I think I'm the only person who believes I'm gonna win, but... Absolutely not, because Gigi Dolan believes we're gonna win. Oh, stop with that. What? Nobody believes in me. Everyone thinks Roman's gonna win, blah, blah, blah. Honestly, it's exhausting. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Stiff. Seriously, how are you still dealing with imposter syndrome after three plus years as champion? I mean, I guess I just... You're so used to people doubting you that you won't let them believe in you. Woods, Rollins, Rhodes, Lesnar, you beat everyone who came for that belt. While Roman, holy art thou reigns, was sipping organic smoothies in an air-conditioned trailer. <laughs> I'm right though. You might not feel like it, but you're not the dark horse anymore. You're the the horse that people expect <laughs> to win. Thanks, GG. I appreciate that. I love being a horse. The favorite? That's right. You're the favorite. So go out there and prove all of us right. Some encouraging words from Gigi Dolan. It is greatly appreciated. Let's go to WrestleMania. Oh snap. Oh, snap. Swing them titles. LA Knight, Seth freaking Rollins, Kevin Owens, new Mania gear, Cody Rhodes. It's time to put the bloodline down. What up, Sammy? Miz. Let's go. Lock in. Lock in. It is about that time. My health is low already. We got to take the fight to Roman Reigns. I didn't even read the prompt. I didn't realize that's what that said. No way. Roman Reigns is taking the fight to me right now. Oh my God. The ground and pound continues. See, Roman, you're lucky that I had to fight Brock Lesnar last night. 
but today is a different day. I got new mania gear. You know what I'm saying? We got to take out the legs of Roman Reigns. Look at that. This man is hurting right now. Already clutching at the knee. You've been gone too long, Roman. Let's go. Turn him around. It's about that time. Standing Spanish fly into the cover. Hook on the leg one. All right. <laughs> You could have at least give me a two. That was my sig, man. Get a hold of Roman with a grab. What up, Roman? What's popping? What's popping? Let's do a little bit of back and forth. A little bit of wrestling spear. Let's go. Roman is down and out. How'd that feel? Taste of your own medicine. Oh, snap. He's not done. No, we ain't tapping. We ain't tapping. Get to the ropes. Miz, Troy, what the hell? You trying to get the bell to ring? Are you dumb? Oh, yup, yup. Sucker punch right to the face. Troy, you next. <laughs> you next, Troy. Brandon, don't get too distracted because Roman Reigns is looking to fly. He takes out Troy. Yeah, you better get back in the ring, Roman. Your attention is on the wrong man. Yeah, Miz and Troy, get on out of here. Yes, sir. Get back in, Roman. We can get crazy. Let's go. Roman Reigns. Oh, he got back in. That's all right. I'm going to take my time. Oh, snap. <laughs> I wasn't expecting him to do that. Yeah, you got baited now, Roman. You got baited now, Roman. Weave. Let's go. Oh, Roman's not playing. Roman's not playing. I might have to use resiliency. Submissions are so broken in this game. I might not have to use it. Let's go. It's going to be a road break, Roman. Back that ass up. Pause. Pause. Roman Reigns going up to the top. You goof now, sir. You goof now, sir. Brandon Collins wants him on his feet. Nia Glory got all of it into the cover. Hook of the leg to retain the championship. But Roman Reigns kicks out. Bro, we're going to send him out there. We're going to send him out there. We're going to give him another WrestleMania moment. Going to do some redecorating. Get up, Roman. Let's go. Roman's up on his feet. Spear connects. We ain't done yet, though. We, oh, he's already fighting back after the spear. Let me have this, Roman. Okay, all right. Roman Reigns sending us back into the ring. He don't want us to have fun. Roman Reigns is back in here. Spear! Oh, my God. He just baited me. Roman Reigns. One, two. No, what the hell was that? I was forced to use my resiliency. I was on it. What the hell was that? Nah, man. Shanann Niggins. Let me tell you. Let's go. Roll through. Double knees. Oh my God. He's in the drop zone. He's in the drop zone, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Let's go. From the top. Frog splash to retain the title. One, two. Let's go. Roman Reigns has been defeated. Your new longest reigning universal champion in WWE history. The Spartan, Brandon Collins. Let's go. Get out of my ring, Roman. Go back to Hollywood. Go film your movie. Took you three years just to film a movie, Roman. Yeah, you sit there and cry. You sit there and remember this moment for the rest of your life. Is Roman, is Roman not done? You want, you want round two? Leave. Leave. This is my moment. There we go. Bring my championships. Pyro going off. Let's go. We are a dominant champion. You love to see it. We've beaten everybody. And now it's time to celebrate. That's what I'm talking about. What a moment. You have completed the undisputed My Rise story. Wow. What a career mode, man. There were some ups, there were some downs, but at the end of the day, we walk out with both championships. If you guys enjoyed and want to rewatch the entire My Rise series, you can click right there. I'll see you guys next time. Deuces.